once upon Shadows on the ground Will there ever be an end? Forever running from this lunacy Moonlight coming down Beaming through the clouds Will I never see the end? Forever searching for my destiny Ladies and gentlemen, the time has hit zero, the song is now done. I hope you all know what that means. It's time for some fun! <laughs> We're back! Just remember, everybody. Surprise, motherfucker. That was well-timed, floof. <laughs> I literally just joined and within half a second I get a surprise MF I don't know whether also, that's well timed or blog <laughs> okay yeah. alright ladies and gentlemen welcome everyone to Pokeception check 
You must have rolled pretty high to find our quiet little stream. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I said it last week when we did normal D&D, &D, and I'll say it again tonight. We're back! Yay! Yeah, thank you so much. I'm so glad I have you right here. Let <laughs> uh, <laughs> Not now. Hey, and on a side note, just before we get started, Hannah has hit us up with the deluxe charge, and she's on a 15 month streak. Woo! Thank you for the deluxe charge. Hey. I have to wait three more days. Oh, don't worry, good man. Oh, don't worry. I will be right behind you when you do. About 35 miles behind you. <laughs> I think I I think I hit my Ford streak. Yeah, you should see Kotlaw. Kotlaw's on 50. Jeez. Damn. <laughs> you realize, though, at the end of the day, all that subscription money goes right back to the channel. Yep. So in the end, we don't get much. Man. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, welcome everyone to Pokeception Check. I am Brownie, your dungeon master or game master, whichever way you want to put me. And joining us tonight is the ragtag crew as you, hopefully, know and love them. We're joined by Aeon. Hello. Del. Hoi, everybody. Lena. Yo. Floof. <laughs> Just in the nick of time, Caitlin. Fucking... <laughs> Fucking made it, boys. You literally just got here as we were doing introductions. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking made it, boys. You know what? For that for that lucky break, Caitlin, you earn this. <laughs> well done. <laughs> I, was, I wasn't sure if that was like a slow clap. Uh, it, it, it was me doing like a... You know, repeatedly. Oh, well done. You tried. <laughs> And big, you got puggers. <laughs> you got puggers. And also, we're joined by Theon. Da, 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 da. Oh my God! <laughs> what? That what was, was that? that was da, 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 da. that was A team. Yeah. That was Moonbase Alpha A team version. Yes, it was. Hey, I'm the only alpha here, boys. <laughs> I already stated what I do, like, before every session, last session, so... Yes, you yeah. did, but you remember, that was over a month ago. Yes, it was. Would have been funny if you did the magic harp. <laughs> the oh, ma you want me to do the magic harp? Oh, no! <laughs> uh... Wait, all of a sudden I hear that sound of the audience in the distance. I think I hear it stampeding here. Go. Go, 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 go. <laughs> I win. That, like, that, that sounded like more of like a dong gong try. Like, dong gong 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 yeah, I know, I know. I'm trying to be, I'm trying to be funny. I'm trying to say to everybody who's here, you know, everyone watching too. Me. So, Ooh. ladies and gentlemen, first of all, how we doing? How we doing to be back? You're doing uh, just fine. I need doing, a... doing okay. I'm trying to remember the the uh, the the game mechanic. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I'm thinking, uh, what does this do again? <laughs> Don't worry, we'll, uh, we'll get into this after all this time. If not, we have Aeon. We do? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> we have Aeon. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> we have Aeon. How much do you know about Roll20? Quite a bit. About Pokey Tabletop? Quite a lot. About how to survive a nuclear explosion? Eh, roll that dice. If you play six, if you play four out. Turn that car off! <laughs> Turn that car off. We're here to play D&D. &D. <laughs> anyway, ladies and gentlemen. Um, first of all, I'd like to say to any viewers who are watching this, um, we are sorry if we mess things up after all this time. It has been a while since we were back at this. 
So hopefully, we'll, you know, do a good job for all of you here. But, I think everyone's waited patiently enough. So, players... It's been a while since I said this on the Pokemon version, but... Are we ready to play? Yes. Yes. I thought you were going to ask us to roll for initiative. Not now! <laughs> Maybe later. Maybe later. Yes. Oh. Uh, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, just before we carry on, we would also like to stress uh, one important thing. Sadly, Heidi cannot join us as she is with some personal, um, uh, a personal event today. So if she somehow joins us, it means she gave up her event for us. And that's a bad. <laughs> if, if Heidi's watching this, let's let you know we love you. Yes. So, if anything else, I hope I'll do Elizabeth justice. Tee -hee. <laughs> anyway, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it's time that we get into this. So, I hope you're all sitting comfortably. It's and now I'm comfortable. Okay, good. All right. Let's get on with this. I have an office chair in my room, so I'm sitting comfortably. I have an office chair, too. Ah. Oh, I miss. I Andrew, miss. I miss. Fine. Oh, sorry, Thad. I was just saying, uh, between the sessions, I had to replace mine. <laughs> I might actually have to replace mine at some point, too, because, uh, ironically uh, enough, the cushion's starting to wear away. Oh, the wood broke underneath my butt from, like, through my last chair. Oh, no support. <laughs> well, hopefully, we'll have some good time with this. Anyway, last time on Pokeception check. The team of trainers brought together for the Hoenn Champi Tag Team Championship Challenge, known as Team Unity, had made their way out of Pelberg City after requiring their first gym badge from gym leader Angela. As you made your way out of the city, you came across a small beach line area where you encountered a small girl by the name of Aria, who was basically being judged? <laughs> thanks, uh, thanks, uh, thanks, Dan. Oh my God! Is this is this one of those Sly Cooper slideshows? I guess. <laughs> where's, where's that? <laughs> if you, you want me to put it back on, I'll do it. <laughs> anyway, you came across Ari on the beach, and also you, who was basically helping to be, uh, who was being helped by a girl that you had just met by the name of Momoko, who had hailed from outside of Hoenn. You helped her and Arya acquire a Pokemon for herself in the form of a child. You also, as you were getting to relax a little, also, why is my damn meter going crazy here? Will you get rid of that? <laughs> I think that's messing up my, I think that's messing up my connection. Okay, uh, I'll, figure, uh, I'll figure out how to get rid of it. You keep going. Thank you. As, as you were all enjoying a nice moment to relax, you also had a bit of an encounter with a group of people that somehow Tycho knew. A group known as the Enforcers, who apparently were, the short term to give it, they are the thugs who think they know what they're doing to protect in their light. You managed to- To protect the world from devastation. Not to now! To <laughs> announce the evils of truth and love. Oh dear lord. Oh, not again. Then I reached the point. James. Anyone who continues that motto is gonna get a, de a disadvantage. Oh shit. <laughs> so consider this your warning. Sorry, Chris. Thank you. You, so anyway, after a bit of convincing from Elizabeth and Momoko, you managed to convince the thugs to disappear off in a northern direction, 
But it appears that Tycho had revealed that he would had a connection with these folks, but didn't want to go into it. Louise went off and he had a bit of a moment with somebody, which we will not get into. Oh my god, why is it... Does is it stuttering uh, again? Just a little it bit. Was. Uh, yeah, a little uh, more time. Yeah. I don't know what's going on with this. It's like I put the okay. You know what? I'm gonna try something here. Let's uh, see. Okay. I'm going to let's see. I'm gonna remove Discord from the exploit and uh, for the uh, Streamlabs and see if that makes it any easier. I did that to try to help who was speaking, but I'll figure that out another time. Anyway, um, after a bit of convincing, you've managed to figure out with the help of Mr. Briney's request that you had to make your way to Rustboro in the form of Momoko having to collect a package for Mr. Briney to get his ship up and running. As it was in your direction, you all decided it was best to work together through Pedalberg. Fucking serious. It is doing it again. It's still happening. What the living fuck? Well, that came through clearly. Of course it did. On a side note, Hannah is busy working on art. Yay, art. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. I don't know why it does this. The problem is, I have to stream this because otherwise it's a. <laughs> Yeah, has this happened? Has this happened on the bottom section? No, because it seems like it's fine when you're talking in like short sentences, but if it if it's long, I think then it starts glitching out. Well, this is gonna be awkward for the GM. I'm so sorry. That's fine. <laughs> anyway, if it hasn't happened on um, Manu, why is it happening here? It's because Cotlo well, hosted. Because... Yeah. Kotlal hosts it for some reason. It doesn't like this. But anyway, we'll keep going and see what happens. If not, we'll have to figure out another plan with this. Even if I have to have drag Kotlal in here to host it. And he just deafens. <laughs> but anywho, um, you all decided it was best to head through Pedalberg in order to get to Rustboro <clears throat> to collect the package. So that way, Momoko could head to Duford and you lot could have fun at Rustboro. So, Team Unity, as you all collect your thoughts after the events that you just went through, you make your way north towards the entrance of Pedalberg Woods, which for some of you, you have, you have entered through before. Now, uh, just a small question I have to ask. Does anybody want to do anything before we carry on? Um... Um, I'm gonna for the just a quick question. Has Holly been past this part of the woods? Uh double checking my notes exactly. Um Yes, so the only people who have not been this direction would be uh would be Arlen, Tycho, and Louise. Everyone else has been through this direction, except Momoko as well. Could I roll something to see if I can get any general knowledge of the woods? Like, recall anything? Sure, make a general education check. General education. The no worries. First roll of the campaign! It's Ooh. mine, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I want a. I wanted to know if I could roll my um, survival check for mm -hmm. um, you know for the purpose of berries. Mm -hmm. Uh, sure, go ahead. Okay. Yeah. I planned this so far in advance, mm -hmm. everybody. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I don't. I don't think I got anything from that. <laughs> uh, six. Um. You at least know that the area is dense, but that's about it. Okay. Uh, no, no worries, thank you. No worries, and we'll allow Tycho a quick nature check because he wants to go berry hunting. Survival. Balls. 
as yeah. per usual, I'm applying skill stunt to this. All right, just for, okay. Oh my lord. <laughs> yep. Uh, wow. Okay. Um, okay. All right. Yep. Uh, you know, with that fourteen, yeah. Um, you do recognize the soil that's up here up top as a general berry area. Uh, as you approach the area and such, you see buried into the ground, um, you see three orange berries buried into the ground. And they are fully buried what? into the ground. Three? I almost spit out my drink. <laughs> <laughs> it's like orange berries is like, holy shit, what? <laughs> How will he fare when he uncovers the golden citrus? <laughs> <laughs> Legend of the golden citrus. Golden Citrus. <laughs> Tycho Porkers. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh so, God. yeah, so, uh, anyway. Tycho, there are three orange berries, but they are dug into the ground. Like, you can just see them sort of there, like, dug in. Like, ah. somebody has dug them. Okay. I will proceed to, uh, take them if nobody, I mean, if nobody else else is around to watch you're gonna take all three of them actually i'll take two you're taking two okay two orange berries for yourself all right so at this point um uh let's see so yeah so the so to verify by the way just so everyone is aware of this holly kemplar and elizabeth are the only people who have come this direction Everyone else, this is your first time going through. Just as the heads up. And with that said, let's go into the woods. Insert fancy screen transition here. I was about to say I couldn't. I wasn't able to see the map for a moment there. I was yeah. going to say I can't. <laughs> you're yeah. So you're all yeah. You're all down here, by the way. So if all of oh. you would like to get your tokens onto the bottom entrance, if you would please. You're so tiny. Look at them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the map. The map. Okay. Uh, there it is. Yeah. Le uh, Lena, you okay with your token there? I see nothing but darkness. Okay. So basically down. scroll down and you'll eventually find the uh, light up area. Yeah, like very bottom. We are so <laughs> tiny. <laughs> what? 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 Can you guys yeah. hear me? Yes. Yes. Yeah. 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 I said, found it. All right. So if you like to <laughs> spawn yourself there onto the bottom. Can you hang on a second here? Let me see. You know how to do that. Uh, yeah. All right. So if you spawn yourself somewhere within the vicinity of the light area, but nowhere beyond uh, the boundaries, if you would, please. <laughs> and this whole time, I realized I did not get forest music. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Which part of music would you have done? I'm trying to remember how to do this. Uh, just go to the journal, find your character, and drag the where it says Momoko Hanami and drag it onto the map. If it'll let me. <laughs> I never had this issue with Topaz. Why am I having it with Momoko? I Tell you what, let me help. Let me help you out, Lena. There you go. Thank you. No worries. No worries. Okay. Oh yeah, her health bar is a bit on the bigger end because of the extra areas on her character. That's the reason. Oh, I can't oh. see her health bar. Look at I. I can see mine in public. Yeah, so you can see your health bar. You just can't see everyone else's. So yeah, Lena has a big health bar according to this, but that's because of the size of the thing. But no worries. Okay. Uh, let me see here. Did I actually... Oh, I really... I generally do not have... Okay, you know what? We'll just put the lake theme from Diamond and Pearl for now. Yes! I love the nostalgia. Well, I thought it was worth it. All right, so you mm -hmm. guys make your way into Pedalberg Woods. 
Now, for the P Fudge Mint people, that is Holly, Kemplar, and Elizabeth, this is the... Going through my notes here. Going through mini notes here. Uh, this isn't your first time going through Petalburg. Petalburg Wood, sorry. You are familiar with the sights of the trees scattered around you, the faint skylight that's emanating from the sky above that's just piercing through the trees, the gentle wind blowing against all of the branches, and the sounds of gentle sort of Pokemon cries in the background. A mixture of deep growls, gentle hoos, and an odd sort of as like leaves are scattering. So at this point, you do have a moment to yourselves if you want to do, take a moment to do something, or we can progress into your adventure through the woods. It's up to you. I, I want to see if there's any Pokemon nearby. I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming. <laughs> Actually, I, um, I want to check to see if there are any ghost types nearby. Oh, I was I was going to um do I was gonna do something first. Uh, okay, you know what? Uh, I'll find out what to- Okay, Tycho, what do you want to do? And then I'll tell everyone to make their rolls if they need to. He was just going to say something to everyone. No worries. Okay. Holly and Louise, make a Pokemon education check. Pokemon education. Yep, to see if you can determine any Pokemon signs around you. Uh, Boop. <laughs> Nope! That's a nope on Louise's butt! Ain't well, no. <sighs> that so. just dandy? <sighs> Four, six. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Hey! Oh, oh. One six. Oh, one crit success, one nap <laughs> fail. Okay. Uh, so, Louise, since this is the first time within Pedalberg for you, you're unsure what to make about the signs around you. So all you can basically tell is the sounds are a little overwhelming for your first time here. For Holly, you do recognize a couple of sounds that echo off into the distance. Though you can't see any tracks, you can recognize a few Pokemon cries in the air. You can recognize the cries of Wurmples, Talos, and... Pokemon cry that you did hear the last time you entered these woods. Uh, do I know the Pokemon cry with uh, that particular... With that roll, no, unfortunately. No, no worries. Um, I basically, I'm gonna, like, tell them the group so they know what type of Pokemon they are. Except, and, but I'll also mention, like, there's, like, this mysterious other Pokemon that I can't recognize the sound of okay so beforehand um elizabeth actually does turn to you momoko for a moment and goes hey momoko mind if i ask you something sure liz what's up uh you said that you, uh, this has been got me curious for a while now but you said you were from outside hoenn right Try. Right. Uh, where exactly were you from again? Jumpto! No, that would explain the Chikorita then, would it? Come to think about it, what exactly are you doing here? I don't think you ever told us why you really came to Hoenn. Long story, but... Hmm. I guess I can tell it. Well, it's up to you, Momoko. You can share what you want to share. Also, is the music still playing for everybody, by the way? Or has it gone quiet? Nope, I hear dead silence. Okay. I I've, I, have it muted so that I can focus on the role play, so and, I can't tell. No worries. Okay, got the music back up now. All right, yeah. So it's up to you, Momoko. You can share with the class what you want. If you want to have a moment to share <laughs> things before we carry on, if you want to. Okay. It's up to you what you want to share. I, I figured I figured nobody really addressed it last part. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I watched it back. Oh. I'm back. Welcome back. Welcome back, Ben. All right. 
Uh, so, uh, is it going to be a walk and talk for you, Momoko? Or shall we just go on what we need to? Or do you want to have a moment? It's up to you. Yeah, we can do... I would, I would say a walk and talk to keep things moving. Okay, so, uh, yeah. I'll leave it to you if you want to explain anything about the backstory part for you. Before we get to the first roll. I mean, first um, event. Can I... Mm -hmm. Oh. Is it possible for me to try to peer into the darkness to try to see more of the room? <laughs> uh, sure. Make a oh. make a perception Wait. check. I I have an idea of how to help you with uh, with that. Um, Fian. <laughs> yeah. Because I have a flashlight. Hmm. I can I can use that. <laughs> <laughs> That'll help later. <laughs> I'm still gonna bring it out and see if we can see. So no, Emily just pulls out a flashlight. No worries. Okay, uh, Kempla, which way do you look? Left or right? Uh, let's look to the right. To the right. Okay, with that 17. Yeah, I think we'll show this much. Will the right be right? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Like, this reminds me of like dungeon crawler. <laughs> That's the point of this. Our, oh boy! Dungeon okay. Crawler. Now, uh, be before we get to if Momoko wants to explain anything, before we do a walk and talk on her bit, if she wants to explain anything, let me explain how this bit's going to work. There are checkpoint intervals where I will allow one person to make a roll on a d10. Depending on the number, a event will occur. Boy. Now I'd also like to point out of this, uh, one of the numbers, I will give you this because it's your first one and I'm being fair, one number is bad. I mean bad. Oh dear. For, wait, for all of us or for specific person no, I'll, let, I'll let you i'll let you find out god doesn't oh. nuke and if we rolled that number we did nuke got it <laughs> all right so don't if don't you... ask just roll yep so <laughs> who would like to go first i volunteers tribute oh floof <laughs> making the first roll all right floof i need to know from you first of all which way do the team go you need, you can discuss you can all discuss amongst each other which way you'd like to go but the decision comes down to floof so yes this is exactly as I threw Lena with in the last campaign oh. uh, mm. we all we all appreciate I your see. noble sacrifice <laughs> you're ready to die <laughs> <laughs> not now. Anyway, uh, yeah. It was nice knowing you, Bloof. Ta Thank you. Tycho um, <laughs> um, relays to everyone that it's, he thinks that it's, we should try going to the right. Right. It's. Um, but, uh, bef before they go, um, <clears throat> Tycho, oh, um, uh, uh, Tycho cleared his throat for a moment. Um, and everyone? I would like to formally apologize for for my behavior uh, earlier on the on the seaside. Hmm. Oh, you don't need to apologize. We understand. Th those guys were um, really really mean, and I understand if you know you don't want to talk about your past. Just know that we're here for you. Really mean. Right. Elizabeth does look at you <clears throat> anyway. for a minute. Oh yeah, Elizabeth does look at you for a minute, Tycho. And she just sort of just tries to give what smile she can and just goes, no matter what happens, just know we're here when you're ready to talk and know that we're here if you need to, you know, if you don't want to talk about it. All right. Uh, yes, sure. Let, let's just go. Alright, so, 
You, if so, I need a confirmation. Do you guys want to have a talk about it? What do you want to do? Uh, um, no. Um, if you don't mind me asking, why right? Shouldn't we go left where it's a little bit lighter? On a technical note, getting rid of Discord from my ex from my Streamlabs has actually stopped this glitch for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> so it's Discord that fucked it. God damn it. Discord called Discord. Got it. Discord used the Discord to destroy the Discord. Get on with it! Now that's true Discord right there. No, anyway. Discord caused Discord. I was going to roll, right? Yeah. Uh, no, I need to know which way. If you guys want to discuss which way you want to okay, go, yeah, but yeah. the decision comes down to Tycho first. I I was just going to ask, like, because you said, like, oh, let's go right. I'm kind of probably, like, ask why right? Why not left where it's a bit lighter and where the path is more clearer? Then, if you do, but you do put it at that day, I guess, I guess it's left would be a viable option. Um, what about the, uh, the rest of you? Mm. By the way, can you guys hear me? Uh, yes. Which, okay, good. Uh, can I roll, or uh, do I know which direction I uh, Kemplar took uh, when he first went through? You know what? Yeah, make a survival check. Survival check. Okay. Yes, survival to know if you remember which way to go. This is surviving a this is surviving <laughs> a forest. I think you need to remember which way you want to go. Oh. Oh wow. Yeah. Well, that's okay. Uh, okay, a ten. All right. You know what, Elizabeth? You know I'll have Elizabeth roll because she she knows a bit about this area too. So we'll see if she can roll to join in. Pretty sure oh, she has like the highest in survival. Uh she has three d six. Oh, same as Kemplar then. <laughs> wow, oh. man. Okay, mental note: I am not rolling again. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I just realized we all rolled a one at some point. <laughs> yeah. We are we are all shit at survival. <laughs> um, um, uses flashlight. Yeah, I can't speak. Did Arlen try and use his flashlight to see um, which path looks like it's been the most used? You know what? I'll give you one more chance, because I'll, I'll give it a chance. You can use a survival check again for yourself. Oh, dear. Actually, hang on, hang on a second. Hang on. You can either use perception to check the area, or survival to check for the for footprints. Uh, let's do a general area check, then, because otherwise I'm rolling one d six. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> perception... perception. Kid, he doesn't go walking through woods. <laughs> Not to self, one of the next uh, skills I improve is survival. Fair enough. A 10. Wait, perception check. Roll credits. Hey! Also, welcome back, Lena. Hey. All right. Peek him, peek him. Okay. Wait, no, that, that's not good because Kemplar rolled 10 too. Yeah, well, Kemplar. Well, Kemplar rolled it with a nat 1, though. Oh. Yeah, yeah so. All right, so Kemplar. With a bit of knowledge to your name, you do recognize a little of the area to recognize that the area you came from before was the left area. Uh, with Arlen's help, you do get a sense that this is a more taken path. Left well, side is the path most yes, trapped, frequently but, trapped. Yes, but you're unsure if it's the road that leads to safety or whether it's the road everyone's taken because it's their first instinct. You don't know that bit. Or if it's the the road that leads to, well, death. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, guys, I'm going to have to push you now. What are you doing? The road to the left is the one that people frequent the most. I say we go there. And yeah. then we can go the other way on the way back. Yeah. Yeah, I go for left. Fine. Okay. okay. All right. So, uh, Tycho, you are leading for this one as you offered. Uh, confirmation. Left or right? 
Well, everyone's wanting to go left, so I'm outvoted. All right. To the left, to the left. Okay, I'm everyone, too. go to the grass area you see before you, please. Uh, other way, Holly. <laughs> oh, to the left. Oh, wait, that's... <laughs> wait. Oh, Did you get your left and right? <laughs> I got my left and right so confused. <laughs> I was I thought we were talking about this side. Wrong Tycho left. Tycho the other left. Goes, Holly, where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I don't. I have trouble with my left and right. Oh. Um, literally, I do. Uh, yes, Lena. Uh, could someone? Could, could someone help me? Could, could you help me pop out Blossom because we forgot her? Well, good point. Thank you. Thank you for the reminder. Oh, I thought we were talking about the other side the whole time. No worries. Okay. We were talking about the left. Oh, oh Tycho. Yes, I know what you do. You don't need to tell me twice. Roll a D10, please. Uh, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Drum roll, please, as I probably Oh, can. one thing, one thing I would like to stress. One thing, um, I'm going to give you all one bonus thing for this as well. Whoever is rolling the D10, when you roll the number, whatever number comes up, I will allow your group one chance to re-roll any D10 roll of any person leading. But only one. Okay. So, for example, if Tycho rolls this and he doesn't like his number, he can do the re-roll. But if he does, no one else can re-roll from that point. You, you got this, Tycho. I believe in you, buddy. So, what we got? Um, that, that's, that's, a, that's a horrible mistake you should make. That's, I, that's, I believe that's... in you. You should have faith. Okay, I believe you. That's exhibits <laughs> A through B. All right, I'm going back to the drum roll. I'm going to do it now. <laughs> and... Oh! Nice. Eight. You know what? I like this roll. You're I'm keeping this roll. You're taking. You're taking the eight. Oh. Yes. Oh, okay. Good to know. That. That. I'm concerned. <laughs> uh, let me just check my notes again. But the DM says good to know. <laughs> that makes me concerned. Oh, trust <laughs> me. Everyone from the other campaign has feared those words too. It could be good. I I like the optimistic. I think it will be good. All right. So you guys make your way. So could you make could uh could I could you all make yourselves to the uh the center of the grass area, please? Oh, wait. All of you? Okay. I I I know my center. I know my center. I may not know my left and right, but I do know my centers. Yep. So around so around the area, basically from here to here. So basically between there. So Louise, you're fine there. Okay. What about your ups and downs, Caitlin? Quiet. Mm, that, that's a bit iffy. All right, so. We'll be learning those as we go. As you all make your way into the center area, uh, with Tycho seeming to lead the charge in his own way, whether serious or... Uh, whether serious or lucky or whatever, as you make your way forward... You hear rustling. Coming from all directions. Mm -hmm. Oh shit! Uh, uh, oh, I would. Uh... I would like everybody. That's everyone. Oh boy! I would like you all to roll a d twenty for me, please. A d twenty. Oh. Every single one of you, a d twenty. Okay. I like those odds. I like. <laughs> <laughs> ah, there it is! <laughs> Why? Ah. That's just really that is just really oh. unlucky. Oh. Right. <laughs> what? Okay, so since you guys roll low, I'm gonna roll high. That's how it works, right? Right. Oh, hang on, I gotta roll for Elizabeth. Uh -oh. Oh, okay. Now we're gonna have us roll high. All right. Okay. So, okay. I need to know the. I need to know the numbers of everyone from the order. Okay. Uh, uh. So going through the order. Okay. Uh. Theon. Nineteen. Okay. Floof. Fifteen. Dell. Uno. Oh. 
Uh, Aeon. I. Lena. Lena. Oh, that. Oh, that. Nine. That's a nine. Caitlin. Seventeen. And Elizabeth with an eighteen. Okay. Anyone who got less than ten, prepare yourself. Uh -oh. <laughs> I was so lucky. I was thinking to myself, okay, these guys have low rolls. I should get a high roll. So, um, as you're all making your way forward, um, let's see. Let me double check my way of wording this. So, uh, Louise, Arlen, and Momoko. The three of you, uh, just sort of glancing around your scenario, whether it's taking in the sights, remembering where you went, you fail to notice some of the rusting as you step forward to the others as you are making your step forward you see a swarm of amongus in front of you Wait, amongus amonguses amongus yes there's a force oh, there's a <laughs> shut up <laughs> i knew someone was doing what? it so wait what, as what you... is amongus amongus is the mu is the mushroom pokemon with the pokeball hands oh that thing yeah the final evolution oh, that's yeah a so, <laughs> as, the, as the lot of you see them sort of buried in the ground, almost like they're hiding, some of you, except for Momoko, Arlen, and Louise, see them and you stop. In the moment, they scurry away quickly. Just as you're about to make a note of this, Momoko, Arlen, and Louise, psh, step on them. <laughs> and a spore oh, extends around <laughs> you. Um, I would like all. The, I would like you three to roll the d4 for me, please. Oh dear. Oh. Uh, can I add? Can Kepler try to add the Amunguses to the Pokedex? I will allow an opportunity. Sure. Okay. Thank you. I will allow one Wait. opportunity. Did you say everyone to roll a one d4? No, just those three. Okay. Because you got lower than ten. I rolled the I rolled in that one, so I'm screwed. No, 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 no. Uh, this is just to affect what the spore's gonna do. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Because oh. if everyone doesn't know, Among Us has effect spore. Remember? Yeah. Yeah, it can put uh. you to sleep or paralyze. Uh, yep. Yeah. So, um, Arlen, with a four. Yeah. Um, you become slightly slightly dazed in your moment and in quick succession <laughs> you fall onto the ground face first asleep <laughs> same thing same, I'm gonna make a joke here same thing happens to Mama Ko and it only takes a handsome prince to wake her up alright <laughs> uh -oh, alright no. um, uh, again, uh, again, again it was just a joke I know alright by the way Rolts is also asleep I am now regretting having picked it up. <laughs> um, Wait, Mama, does your roads have synchronized? Uh, good, qu insomnia? good question. What does the roads have as ability, Aeon? That is a very good question. I will give you a very good answer. <laughs> <laughs> does it have synchronized? In about three minutes. I know, I know that it does have synchronized. Okay, yeah. so with that, the Among Us that you stepped on goes to run and then um, <laughs> just falls asleep. <laughs> Arlen, at least, please tell me Arnon at least falls on it. <laughs> no, he just misses it to avoid effect spore going off again. <laughs> All right, uh, Momoko, you, uh, hold on, sorry, go in the order of this numbers. Uh, Louise, you got three? Yeah. Uh, Louise and Puppet are paralyzed. Oh. <laughs> uh, can, wait, can can they can she still talk? Uh, very subtly. Kind of like a. Uh, uh, oh. I'm gonna see what Mon Momoko get because I might have some good news. No worries. Okay, Momoko, uh, you rolled the one. Uh, net one. Okay. Uh, with the one, you'll be happy to know this works in a slightly another way. So, Momoko, in the word to put it, pick your poison. Oh, <laughs> you? Poison. No, you? Can, no, 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 not poison. I meant she picks. Would you like to be asleep, paralyzed, or poisoned? Oh. 
Wow. Sleep. Asleep. Sleep. Okay. So in quick succession, Momoko basically steps on it, and the same thing happens to her and Chikorita as Arlen. <laughs> All right. Wait, uh, wait, Chikorita. It, uh, Chikorita won't be affected, right? Because it's grass type. That's yeah. right. Yes. Sleep does. Yes. A p powder moves don't affect grass types anymore. So yes, Chikorita's not asleep. Is effect spore considered a powder move though? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, I will for my campaign. Can I? All right, I'm gonna. I, get uh, the uh, what's up? Can I, can, I, can I try something out for a blossom? Sh oh, sure. Go on. Well, first off, she tries to wake up Momoko with no luck. Okay. <laughs> I think... because, because are you familiar with the term dead asleep? Yes. <laughs> that's, what Momoko, that's what Momoko is right now. All right. I... Right. She, kind of... she is like dead asleep. You would have to have a very loud alarm to wake her up. I, I kind of have an idea. Oh, oh. So, um, I... I want to ask the DM first. Hello. <laughs> okay, so since Louise is paralyzed, would I be able to use my one paralyzed heal to unparalyze her? Uh, it is a paralyzed spray, so it would only pa it would unparalyze either puppet or Louise. Yes. No worries. And one more question, because I kind of want to catch that Among Us. Uh, the Among Us that's before her back to sleep, is it next to us? Fucking hate the synchronized moment, I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah, like, uh, I'm, I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna get the, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get the friggin' Pokedex. <laughs> I forgot about this. <laughs> yeah, this Among Us, the mushroom Pokemon, it lures play very close by dancing and waving its arm caps, which resemble Pokeballs. After this, it takes them up into space to play a little game. God damn it, that's a fake. <laughs> half of it was true, half of it was fake. I rolled a nine. That was a could, could, could someone please send me a picture of what this sucker looks like, please? I am, I, I, I am getting its picture because I've got to spawn it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh my god. Pictures I'm in so general glad. for you to look at in the meantime. It's not transparent, so I wouldn't translate. All right, all right, anyway, thank yeah. you. You're welcome. <laughs> wow, I type in Among Us and I get Among Us as the first and the Pokemon second. Wait, <laughs> wait, oh wait, I might. I don't think I can catch it. Do I not have any? What? I don't... No, I don't think I have any Pokeballs anyway. Pokeballs? <laughs> <laughs> I think. Yeah, I'm not, I can't see any of Pokeballs. I must have run out of Pokeballs. Wait, no, wait. Oh, wait. What do I do? I have four basic balls. Okay. <laughs> I was scared for a second. I was thinking, wait, I ran out of Pokeballs already? Um, I, um, Chris, I, um, I, um, I was gonna say, at this point, um, like, like, when all of this has occurred, Tycho just bursts out laughing. <laughs> I'm perfectly fine with that moment. <laughs> also, yeah. uh, Lena, I think your Chikorita has something, I think. <coughs> let me double uh. let me double check on something for just a moment with his Chikorita. Ah, uh, oh, okay. You know what, Louise? Uh, no, sorry. Um, Momoko, one moment, please, before anything else. Yes, what's up? As you're asleep and Chikorita is just looking at you, all of you get a glance after Louise uses the spray a bit. Chikorita begins to lift its flat, its leaf above its head and wave it over you, Momoko. You are no longer asleep. Oh. Because the Chikorita has natural cure. I knew it. I knew it. Oh my god. <laughs> so, so, Doesn't that mean that Chikorita could use it on all the other Pokemon? Uh, yeah. Cool? Yeah. Oh, that means it'll have to use Paralyze Heal. Thank God. Yeah. That's true. <laughs> oh yeah. So there is there is a Paralyzed Ghost and a Paralyzed Girl, by the way. 
<laughs> there's also in a there's also a sleepy boy and two sleepy Pokemon. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. 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 Well, since Momoko is awake now, she is going to try and have Blossom do the same thing with Arlen and Rolf. Okay. Uh, it is going to be one at a time with a bit of a time interval. So I will say, if you want to do it for everyone else, it is going to take you about ten minutes. Okay. <laughs> nobody glad you. I'm so glad nobody had a wake up slap. All right. I'm well, going to spawn well, thank, the Among Us. Well, thank. Well, th hey, thank you for letting me. Um, thank you for letting me know about that. That actually helps. <laughs> All right. Uh, so so you you really going to try catching Among Us? Yeah, of course. What have I done? I, I have to ask: is that, is that the evolved version of the Pokemon that spawns in the Plains biome and Pixelmon? If you mean fungus, oh, if you mean fungus, yes. That's what I thought. I thought it looked familiar because I've been at Pixelmon numerous times and I've seen the fungus in there and I'm like, okay, is this the evolved version of it? <laughs> no worries. All right, so catching the Pokemon. Um, Aeon, can we get your verification on this one more time, please? Because it's been a while. We certainly can. I shall look up the capture rules. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm looking up the capture rules as well. Okay. <laughs> So while that's going there, uh, I'll say this, you have one chance to catch Among Us. No worries, that's fine. Because I also, think it's... Um, as, as Mamaka as wakes up, Tycho is almost done with his laugh. Bit, his, his laugh. He can't possibly <laughs> write this stuff. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this was supposed to be a punishment, not an actual thing. I didn't plan this. <laughs> I mean, I'm not gonna think of the cat. <laughs> well, I mean, all of, well, I mean, cat block got a bead roll by my problem, so why not? <laughs> First off the bat, I, I do remember that the uh, cat, the uh, accuracy check for throwing a pokeball is. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> is what number? Aeon? Sorry, accuracy Aeon. check of six. Six. So, okay. So, Holly, um, you actually have to throw a ball and get higher than six. So, so. is it 1d20? Yep. Yep. Yeah. So, a d20, okay. so and you've got to get higher than six to actually connect. Okay. I'm slightly nervous. I'm not going to lie. And you should be. Oh, 18. Oh, yeah. Okay, so how does the capture part work? Head on. Uh, once the Pokeball hits, you roll the capture roll, roll 1d100. And then, and... And then it's, it's like twice the Pokemon's level, right? Twice the Pokemon's level subtracted from 100 plus another 10, or if it's fully evolved. Yep, it's and a fully evolved to... Mon. So... Roll the 100. Um, and so... Sorry. <laughs> it's alright. After that, it's... After that, you add one number to it for every point of health lost. <laughs> it is fully then... healed. What about... And then... There's something for statuses that I can't seem to think of Level. right now. Give me a minute. I need to actually double check about Among Us. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's fine. I planned this. Also, question: Has it been ten minutes in game time? Uh, I will. I will say once this capture goes off, I will say you have a few minutes. So yeah. So you know what? Okay. Oh my fucking god! I forgot it evolves at such a high level. The ball bat. Oh, well, you've also uh, you've made it so that beat drill evolved at a lower level than ten. So yeah, it normally evolves at thirty-five. Whoa. You know what? Right. You know what? I'm gonna. You know what? I'll be generous and say level ten. But I'll say freak hazard. Are you sure? Yes. Well, it's either that or I give you a level thirty-five mon. 
<laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ooh, so. I, like, no. No. Oh. Oh yeah. Cause, oh yeah. Because I got. Oh yeah. Now I remember. Sorry. Thank you. Go uh, ahead. I, I was, so. <laughs> uh, so fifty-eight. So it's a full health. Yep. So that takes thirty off the roll and brings it to twenty-eight. Capture, right? Yep. So twenty-eight. Uh, I need to... Act. So, what's the number it has to get again? Sorry, it's been a while since we did this, everybody. We're so sorry. <laughs> you start with 100, you take twice its level off, you said 35, so that brings it down to capture rate of 30. Uh, it's above 75 hit points, so it loses another 30. That brings it down to nothing. <laughs> uh, has no evolutions remaining, that's, a, that's at minus... N. Uh, it's got a persistent condition, so that puts it back at zero. So essentially, you, I believe, uh, will have to roll a perfect number to catch it, so it's uncatchable. Oh. Yeah, I don't think I caught it. No. Uh, I'm sorry. No. We caught. Fair enough. Okay. All right. So you throw the ball. It hits the Among Us and. It breaks out after the first shake. Oh, I don't. And as it does so, and it jets off into the woods. And at that point, the pa and at that point, Chikorita is done. It heals everybody up. Chippin. <sighs> So a blossom just runs uh, runs up to sort of you, Louise, and just sits in front of you, going "Ticker." I okay, and I'm no longer paralyzed. Yes. I give I give the chikorita a small smile, and pat its head. Tika. <laughs> I'm try. I miss doing these Pokemon cries. <laughs> <laughs> Psycho still laughs a little right. from the event yeah. that transpired. Elizabeth, go, oh, I, sorry, go ahead. Oh, sorry. No, you first. No, I was just gonna. <laughs> no, I, all I was just gonna say was I was going that after I pet Chikorita, I'd go back to my default face. <laughs> oh. I, uh, I, I, yeah. I then, I then walk up to Blossom and give her a little rub on the head. Chika. Yeah. You did really good, Blossom. Thank you so much. Chika. <laughs> I then pick up Blossom and give her a hug. Aww. Oh, okay. yeah. Elizabeth just look oh. Elizabeth just looks over at this and just goes, Now ain't that precious. <laughs> Still though, I think that means we're gonna have to be a lot more careful if we're gonna have to worry about stuff like that happening again. Mm -hmm. are, you, are you guys okay? Yes. Oh. oh. Mm-hmm. Thanks to Blossom here. Uh, oh, I'm so much blossom. Uh, Alan, are you okay too? Alan's just sat there, irresistibly trying to brush the dirt off his trousers. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Holly, Holly then walks up to uh, Alan and, with a sleeve, gently like rubs off a bit of like uh, mud that was probably on his cheek. Here you go. <laughs> Thank you. Ask, does Arlen come from like a wealthy family or something? And I'm asking as a player, not a character. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I kind of, I kind of figured as much. You'd have to ask him to know about that. In fact, yeah. If you guys want a few minutes to recuperate and do things, you can do that. If you want to ask any questions in the game or whatever, if you want to. Otherwise, are we ready for the next one? I'm good. Oh, I'm gonna go. <laughs> good. Yes, I do. My name is Alan Montgomery Van Doren Kratzel de Larry the Third. <laughs> I forgot about that damn name. I forgot about oh. that damn name. <laughs> He's got a mile long name, kind of pretty much says it all. <laughs> no offense, no offense, Anne. I hope you're not offended by that. Bacon. <clears throat> can... <laughs> Can't take... All right, so, um, who's taking the next one? Me, I want to do it. Oh. <laughs> okay, so Holly, your choices are go backwards or carry on. What are you doing? 
Hold on, let me check my fingers. Let me check, making sure I know my last one. <laughs> you have ten fingers. Why would you have any more or less? <laughs> no, it's 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 a rule that you can do with your fingers to determine left and right. And even still, I fuck it up. Yeah, in fact, you guys can probably do this at home to double check this. If you take both your hands and make L's with them, like the thumb and the finger next to it, and hold both hands in front of you, one of them looks like an actual L. That is left. I'm... There you go. Okay, so Fun fact. I'm going to go... I'm going to go up. Let's yeah. go go up. Okay, you're going up. All right. Uh, is everyone agreeing with that? Sure. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Can I try to see through the darkness again? Okay, yeah, I'll allow you one perception check if you'd like to. Also, the answer to your the answer to your other question. And what the hey? Oh, well, that was a terrible roll. That was. I'm so sorry, Campbell. <clears throat> That's all right. All right, ten. You can hear the sound of a Pokemon you're unfamiliar with, but you do get a. But as well as not seeing anything, you do begin to hear a noise a bit further into the forest, though. You begin to hear sort of like this. Oh, oh. That you were going to make a joke and say that you can hear a sound off in the distance. Garp! It would just be. Garp! <laughs> All right, Bye. so that's Bye. what you got there. So if everyone likes to make their way to the next <clears throat> checkpoint, please, which is the furthest reaches of that light. So do I roll a 1d10? Yes, you do. Everyone, Once we get there. Yeah, everyone, please oh. move up, and you go no further than the light's edge. I'm tempted to jinx Caitlin. In what way? <laughs> Wait, what was he doing? He says he's tempted to jinx Caitlyn. No, don't jinx me. I supported you. <laughs> Why jinx me? I didn't do anything. I did nothing. I do it, I do, I do it for the community value. You know? <laughs> Just let me. Con content, content, content. <laughs> Go ahead. All right, what are you doing then, eh? Uh, Taiko, are you actually going to do something, or are you generally standing back? Uh, standing back. You're standing back. Uh, like, right, right, right here. Okay. Good. Uh, Holly, <laughs> roll another d10 for me, please. Uh, now you know, so don't get an eight. <laughs> Tiger doesn't need to do anything. I'm already full of bad luck anyway. No worries. Just remember, don't roll an I've eight. A five is okay. Oh. Five. Okay. Right. Um, as you're making your way through the Petalburg Wood area... Something sparkly catches your eye, Holly. What is it? It's tiny. Do you want to check it out? Yes. Okay. You check it uh -huh. out. You check it out. And just uh, just about up here, just basically, in fact, uh, you know what? Let me give me a minute here. I'll do this quickly because you guys can see it. Oh, God damn it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Motherfucking roll to it. Yeah. Fucking bullshit. Fuck it. Damn. <laughs> there. Sorry, I tried to reveal areas, and for some reason it made them dark again. <laughs> All right, uh, you find near that cliff edge, you find two Pokeballs. Oh. Oh, look here, got two Pokeballs. Yep, two Pokeballs for Caitlyn as she led that as she led that moment. Next gain of one. Yep. So, so you know, a five is worth something in certain areas. Wow. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Who's handling the next one? Me next. Oh, Louise. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, Louise, uh, your choices. Mm -hmm. Backwards, down, or right? Right. So, you're going to carry on? Carrying on. Okay, uh, your next part is right to the uh, actually, uh, you know what? Sure. Actually, you know what? Let's have some fun with this. Let's do this. Uh -oh. Okay. Go to, uh, I'd like you to go basically, um, no further than here, please. So no further than this spot where my thing is, if you would, please. Yeah, that's the furthest I want you to go. All right. 
Carry on my own way. Roll. Uh, yeah. Roll your d10. Um, yeah, then you just go. Oh, Two. Okay. I'm trying to move. Uh, oh my I'm... fucking god! Really? What? <laughs> of all the people to get this. Huh? Okay. Well, Good to know. Right. <laughs> right. Uh, what? What I get? <laughs> One of the one of the interesting numbers. <laughs> one moment, everyone. He could be screwed. Uh, yeah. uh, okay. it's one of the interesting numbers. Hmm. All right. So as you're making your way there, um, <clears throat> as you're leading the moment. Tycho, oh sorry, um, Holly and Kemplar, as you make your way further into the forest, you begin to hear that same Pokemon cry that you heard before. That, oh, oh. and as you get closer, you suddenly hear the sound of, all right, watch it, you. I thought I told you, we're gonna go and sort this out. Now, hand them over. No, I don't intend to. Not now. Hmm? Can can me? Can I? Can can I? I'd like to try uh, to determine. Uh, yeah, I wanna. Well, actually, you can actually. Uh, you don't have to do a. Da you do not have to do a damn thing, because there's something you would actually know, right in front of you. Uh. Oh. oh. Ghost types. <laughs> so, Arthur, oh, hang on a minute. Aren't those two assholes? <laughs> oh, they have a trubbish. I love trubbish. And oh, they have a telly. Yep. Wait, so at that point, hang on a second. Let me get this. As you guys make your way closer, you get the some. You do recognize that these are two of the figures you saw before, and the girl you see before you is a girl you haven't seen around these parts before. But you do recognize one Pokemon with them, being the Petilil, and the other two Pokemon, as one of them is clinging to the girl, you begin to hear the cry that you heard from before, the... Oh. And as you're getting closer, the thugs basically have the girl on surrounded and goes, Now listen here. I don't care about the little weakling weed there. Just give us the two cool-looking ones. What's a pretty girl like you doing with such a scary looking Pokemon? As enforcers, it's our job to keep people safe, and you don't deserve the big scary curse upon you. Now can hand I, them over! Uh, can I have, um, can I have Mochi use Wondershock on the guy? Do you, you're, you're gonna unleash an attack! Yeah. Well, actually, I am not going to allow it because Louise is heading this one. So it's up to Louise. Oh, all right. Oh. That's, why I, that's why I had these head moments. I, I look at, I look, and then, then I, I walk up, I walk up to one of, oh, I walk up to one, one of them. Oh, shit. Uh -oh. One of them, one of them does look you, in your direction and goes, "Eh." Leave them alone. I glare. Oh. I glare at them. Oh, look. <laughs> hey, look at this, Phil. Another go another spooky one with another fair, pretty lady. So later. Oh my God. Wait a minute. <laughs> Phil, Phil, look! It's him! It's him! It's him! It's the one that messed with the boss. Well, I'll be damned. Oh, I've been waiting for this one. Is he talking about Tycho? You can assume that. And at that point, you hear the folks go, Right, lads, break time's over! <whistles> and as that point happens, coming out from the trees behind you, Uh... Right, more. Oh. oh, oh boy. Yeah, yep, yep. Welcome to the number you really didn't want. <laughs> I 
Okay. Uh, Might as well I, I have such a good feeling about this. Alright, as as uh at Louise, as you're speaking to the figure, the girl is looking at you and is just clinging to all three of her Pokemon that are around her. Phantom, the stump Pokemon. According to legend, medicine to cure any illness can be made by plucking the green leaves on its head, brewing them, and boiling down the liquid. There you go. I Oh my god, I, I thought you said I, I thought you said Oh, I'm gonna get so much hate for this I thought you said fucking the leaves I was like, what? <laughs> no, no, brewing the leaves Brewing, brewing. Okay. I had to do a double take, I'm like, what? At that point, by the way, yeah. they go Alright, nice for a little payback Phil You help the lady Out of here Lads! Get him! Everyone, roll for initiative! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Uh, give me a minute, oh, no, no, no. give me a minute, give me a minute. Wait, ourselves or our Pokemon? Uh, get your Pokemon if you would, please. Uh, so if you right click your tokens, do uh, there should be an add a turn on your token, I think. Um, I think like, so. on the setting circle, like the gear. Uh, give me a minute. Let me, let me see what I can do here. Sorry about this, everybody. It's been a while. Yeah, uh, the currently, uh, currently aren't any tokens. You lie to me. It says, it says that, uh, no, it says that, uh, ah! Game is stupid. What the Let's see. Oh, All that, right. that Token settings, it. yeah, I can't quite add a turn, but... I, first of all, love uh, how you're using Team Skull's theme. Thank you. Give me a minute, I'm adding the Pokemon to the list. Oh, I was just gonna do this. There you go. Well, I have to. I have to add all. I have to add your Pokemon to my list thing before you can roll the initiative, and then I can. And then does it. Okay. I. I don't remember which one's the initiative one. I'm trying to find it. Okay. So, so on your Pokemon's character sheet, yep. if you scroll down to the bottom of the stats section, you'll see the initiative section. Yeah. Make sure that. Make sure the number box. <laughs> yep. Zero oh. bonus, and then click the dice. Yes. All right. Bye. All right. Boop. What was I? Um... Okay, uh, Louise. Uh, okay. Uh, wait. Why did puppets not initiative not get added? Uh, I don't know. Okay. How how do I do this? Okay. So on your Pokemon's character sheet, oh, Pokemon at character. the bottom of the stats section, there's a splash section labeled initiative. You've got Make to sure that highlight your Pokemon tokens as well. Yeah. Once that's, oh yeah, highlight your Pokemon token when you roll initiative or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, make make sure that your. Uh, make sure that your. There we go. Make sure that your initiative. Make sure that your initiative uh, box is zero, and then click on the die, under the initiative section. Figured it out. Yeah, I'll help you out, Lena, with your one. It's at the bottom, right? Uh, yeah, bottom of the stats section on the character sheet. Yeah, so stats go to your Pokemon, go to character sheet. Oh, initiative. Okay. Yeah, so make sure zero. it's zero and click the dice yeah. block. Okay, I got it. Dice block. Uh, oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Give me a minute. I think I might actually still have these uh, these initiatives. Good lord, I actually have to so good lord, I actually have to look at my initiative again. <laughs> yeah. Okay, for some reason it decided to add a second one. Okay, and Eevee is the last one. Sorry everybody, we planned this so far in advance. We planned this! It's been a while. It's been a while. taking the initiative. Huh? Uh-huh. Wait. It's always fun seeing the GM take the initiative. Yeah, fun. <laughs> uh -huh, oh, fun. But wait, wait. Evie has a nine in initiative. Yeah. Yeah. Because it because the base initiative calculation is what the frick is up with Beatrice? Oh, the plus nine was there. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Wait, yeah, why does Beatrice like, have nine? Like, no, like. No, like Be Beatrice's initiative number next to the dice was not zero. 
So it added nine on top of it. Okay, so for some reason it decided to do something else. Okay. Yeah. For, okay, good to know. Right, let me fix that. <laughs> so unless there's something I've missed in this, there we go. Yep. Yeah, there you go. I'm going to rush to the bathroom while we get this sorted out. No worries. Anyway, yep, it's all pretty much sorted. So, top of the order, Mochi, off you go. You go first. I am... Um, okay. So... Okay. I'm nervous. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> We've done um, a little bit of two Team Skull music. <laughs> all right. We believe in you. Uh, I... I'm glad I don't. I don't. Wait. Um, oh, did you say, did you say glad? I got a bit of music to play. Caitlin, don't get distracted. <laughs> oh, hey, I know this one. <laughs> <laughs> I know this one. Gladian right. senpai. I love Gladian. <laughs> get out. All right. So, all right. Um, I can. Uh, so the guy that is. Um, I think one of the guys said they were going to, like, grab the girl, right? You can assume that. Unless Louise didn't pass it on. But yeah, um, I'll she, say... I'm there, I'm there too far apart. Uh, she, I'll, I'll, I'll say... Trying... Yeah, I'll say you catch wind that they call... You, you catch wind that one of them... Actually, you know what? The one who shouted it was the one who declared all this. So, yeah, he shouted it out. That's my fault. All right. I'm going to have... Um... um Mochi stop him. Um, I'm gonna guess he's gonna use the rubbish. So, oh, would I be able to make it? It's been so long. I'm so sorry. It's all right. Did everyone think they were gonna know a battle tonight? <laughs> I, I figured we might. I, I, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. It's okay. It's okay. Also, I have something to say really quick. I know, now I know I was looking at the wrong thing, so can I go on ahead and do the roll for Blossom just on my end, please? Uh, you know, uh, yeah, you know what? Go ahead. If you know what you're doing with it, go for it. Okay, uh, what's the... Right. Oh, it's okay. about, it's the okay. same number, so it doesn't change the order. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. change the order. Oh. I just wanted to do it because, you know... Yeah. No Beatrice uh, or uh, Blossom's role is being privately sent to the team. Yeah, it was literally was seven point one seven. Okay. So it's not why, much of a difference. Yeah. Why is it being why is it being sent privately where it should be for everyone to see? No idea, but the same thing happened to Oponor during our gym battle, so it's okay. Okay. We can check that. Uh, we can check it afterwards. Okay. So if I can, I'm gonna have Mochi go over to the trubbish that was um oh sorry 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 how many spaces can um, mochi go um on overworld i don't i don't know i don't i'll um, i'll look it up well, because, because i'll, I'll look it up uh, oh my god seven 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 wow pikachu can oh. move seven squares so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right. And what's the right? And I'm gonna use uh the EC. Yeah, just declare what move you're using, and then click the buttons to roll all. I'm gonna this use... should be a roll all. I'm gonna use Thunder Shock. All right. On which one? Um. The uh, guy uh, on the fuck, on the right, on the right side, the fur, the furthest. This one. one. Yes. Can you reach? Um, hold on. What's Thunder Shock's distance? Um. Just click the wrong thing. Sorry. So. That's fine. So DB. Does that mean the? That's damage. That's damage base. Hang on, I'll look it up for um, you. Oh wait, range four. Plus one range four. Yeah, so you have a range of four squares. So does she have four range to reach it? Let's see. One, two, three, four. No, she doesn't. She Just doesn't missed it. Oh. You can hit no, this one, though. Yeah, I'm going to hit the other one then. All right. Roll the Thundershock. 
I'm so sorry, guys. I really am. No, it's cool. Everyone's getting a lesson. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think it's this one. Uh, that's that's uh, damage. That's the damage roll. Uh, let me just double check something. I'm gonna use. All oh. those. I believe you know, under known moves, if you just click on the name, it'll do both accuracy and damage. Non move, no non moves. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. So just click on the name of the move, and it'll use it for both accuracy and damage. So it's such... a. Oh yes. That'll hit, and wow. that is, and that's paralyzed because it's a seventeen. Wow. For which, for which, which one was paralyzed? Well, the one next actually, to you. Oh. Actually, her roll was a 19. Remember, it subtracts it subtracts the accuracy roll automatically. Oh, that's right. So yeah, so yeah, that's a well. It's it's it has to be 17 plus on it. So yeah, so yeah, paralyzed rubbish. Oh goody. Wow. All right. So. Wow. <laughs> you leave her alone. <laughs> Shit. Hey, yeah, what? So... Where did that one come from? Pikachu. <laughs> All right. Okay, so do you need help calculating Trubbish's health, Chris? No, I, I have I have a I have a character sheet of every Trubbish. Oh, every Trubbish. Ooh. They're all the same. So I got it. Uh, how I... much damage exactly? Is that... Twenty-nine. I believe that's twenty-nine points of damage minus one hundred and twenty points of damage minus the special defense of the Trubbish. Yep. Good. Good to know. Good. To, good to know. Oh boy. Um, yeah. So he's paralyzed. So I'm gonna have to mark a token on him so we don't forget. Good call. All right. Yeah. Trubbish. Tra 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 <laughs> hey. <laughs> All right. Is that it for the turn for Mochi, or do you want to do anything as a trainer action? Um, trainer action. Uh, what steps can I do? By the way, Reggie, um, be ready. Yep. Step, 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 step. Uh, I'm probably just gonna like, move like next to Mochi. Do you have that enough Overlord? To oh, Overlord. <laughs> Why do I keep saying oh, Overlord? Oh, Overlord. <laughs> go die, my dog, go die. <laughs> Quiet, you. I think oh. edges. Oh no, that's edges. Um. Mm. Look under capabilities at the top. It's under evasions. Uh, you have five. Five. No worries. So, um, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, I'm going to stand next to the vaults here, and I'm just going to have Holly, like, say, like, leave, leave her alone. Oh, another lady. What is this? This is our lucky dip. Hey, wait, that mouse belongs to you. What did you do to my bag? <laughs> Good night, everybody. <laughs> yeah, that's what it's called. I'm not joking. <laughs> Revive. I've only like, like got one thing to say. Dead. Revive. Anyway, uh, Reggie, off. Reggie and Tycho, off you go. He's gonna. He's gonna eye the. Uh, the. Uh, the guy at the trubbish on the. Uh, Top left here. Okay. Uh, this one. Red moves. Two squares. Um. Okay. <clears throat> All right. I have been. I have been wanting to do this to one of you for a long time. Reggie, bubble. All right. Launch the bubbles. <laughs> the range of, of this is um burst one. Uh. Oh. Bubble burst one means that it only has a radius around it of one tile in which it would hit. So you have to be Wait. standing right next to it. Oh, uh, you know what? Smoke screen then. Oh shit! Okay. It will. I have been waiting to do this to one of you for a long time. Smoke screen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, roll the smoke screen if you're doing it. <laughs> Um, um, this doesn't require a. Um, this doesn't require a role. Oh well then. Uh, could you uh, could you at least click on the name so that we can see it then, please? I, I, I think I think Caitlin has officially cracked. Oh. Oh, I'm so sorry. All right. 
Nick, Caitlin, there's no need for you to be sorry. <laughs> I'll get it. I'll get it. I'm looking this up. <laughs> I got Caitlin, uh, Caitlin Hunt, there's no need for you to be sorry whatsoever. There. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I mean So Range blast of three. So can create plants of smoke that covers the target area. The tar smoke persists until the end of the encounter or until defog or whirlwind are used. All targets attacking from or into the smoke receive a minus three penalties act. Yike. Oh. Okay, good to know. Okay, so that so... submission has got minus three. Smoke speed will apply around, like, right around this area. I... Yeah, because you, you can choose a square within five and it blasts out for three. Yeah. In, we need um, to look up our moves a lot more. We do. <laughs> yeah, we're looking this up afterwards. Anyway, let's move on with this. Is that it for your turn, my dear friend? Um, yeah, smoke screen will apply, um, like, the space in between Reggie and the Trubbish. Okay. That's okay, fine. so one, two, ooh. Okay. If you, if you want to, if you want uh, to me, come and find me. Hey! What happened? I can't see shit. I can't hear you. It's too dark. <laughs> I can't. I can't hear. <laughs> you know, I, I'm having trouble hearing with my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Is that it for your turn, uh, Floof? Uh, yeah. I can't do much unless this rubbish is like no. right up to Reggie's face. All right. Well. Uh, next is Evie, so I will make this quick for Heidi because Dell is looking very impatient right now. Meow. Okay, let me double check Evie's Meow. level. Oops. Ooh. I have Ooh, I'm gonna have some fun with this. Oh boy. Oh. Boy. Uh, Elizabeth goes. No worries. I think we got this. I think. I think we might need a little moment to focus on the front. Beatrice, get up there! Evie! So Evie is going to do something quite interesting. Uh, mm. With a four. One, two, three, and four. I wonder if she has enough room. Uh, Does she uh -oh. have enough space to do this? Um, what you doing? Give me a minute. Give me a minute and I will tell you. Helping hand. That's exactly what it is. Oh, oh I was joking. I was joking. <laughs> she has she has helping hand. What does helping hand do? Um, you're about to find out. She goes, okay, okay, Evie. Oh yeah, okay, Beatrice, love. Get bottled up. It only has a range of four, unfortunately, but she's going to use helping hand and. Oh boy! Prepare for some uh, fun on this one. I'm getting the move, and you can see your buffs. Uh, okay. Plus two Hugging on hand. its next accuracy roll, and plus ten to its next damage roll. Oh. This is gonna be good. Who, who, who is it for? Was it just for Chikorita and the vault? Uh, it's to Bogdal. Bogdal. To oh. Is it burning trash unsafe? <laughs> We're gonna find out. <laughs> we'll find out in a minute. Well, I mean, if you this fight, maybe not. All right. Uh, and at this point, Elizabeth is gonna stay at the back and just goes, Oi, before you get to them, just know you gotta get through me. She's trying to intimidate the one at the back to focus on her. Ooh. Oh, okay. All right. Not for intimidation. Yeah, uh, yeah, you know what? I will give her a roll very quickly. Uh, be ready, Del. You're gonna be up in a minute. All right. <clears throat> and then Theon, be ready. Okay. Intimidate. Oh my god, she has 46. <laughs> That's it, okay. He's, <laughs> look, he's just looking kind of... Mm -hmm. it's, it's hard to tell from what his glance okay. is from the distance, but he's just unnerved. Yeah. All right. You can audibly hear him gulp. <laughs> just a tad. <laughs> All right. Uh, Puppet and Louise, go. Oh. Oh, all right. I'm gonna have puppet move here. And I'm gonna have. Okay. Uh, can I. St 
Oh, um, do I have to start with the Pokemon move first, or could I start with the trainer action? Whatever you like to do. Okay. It, okay. No, so. I just realized I... Norm normally the Pokemon indicates the end of the turn. I forgot to. I forgot about that. So I'll, I'll allow this turn. You can do it in any order you want. Uh. Oh. <clears throat> oh. Any Gladian, oh, okay. any Gladian fans holding the hand in front of their face right now? Now I am. <laughs> why, why, why do you have to call me out like that? <laughs> Just okay. for the fun record, and remember we did Pokemon Sun and Moon, and I remember Caitlin went Gladian Senpai. <laughs> why are you going to say that, dude? Why are you going to say that? <laughs> I'm embarrassed you. It's fun. Okay, I don't know if I can do both. Actually, I don't know if I can do both of these in the same turn. Uh, the easy way to determine that, I just think, is the AP points that you've got. Uh, oh. All right, you know what? You know what? I'll start with... Oh, you know what? I'm just going to do this. I'm going to have Papa use knock off on the paralyzed Trubbish. Oh, okay! We're just bullying at this point. Seven. That's a 30... That's 31! Well, yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> yep, that'll easily do it. So as it's paralyzed, and you look at the tra and his trainer just go, no, bag, don't worry, I got gotcha. you. And as he reaches into his pocket to pull out an item, boonk, and the trumpet falls off, faint fall off fainted. I feel bad, because I like Trubbish. Ah. Oh. Oh. Oh, it got rid of it from the turn order. Fortunately, I know where it goes on the turn order. It's before Kizuna. Yeah. I have a question. What goodies do you get if you if you faint? <laughs> uh, that's that's a question we ask later. <laughs> I was trying to make it funny. I know. Which was successful. <laughs> All right. What else, Louise? Okay. Um, all right. I okay. I'm gonna have Lou. I'm okay. Um, so at will and so what's the difference between at will and standard actions? Uh, uh, a standard action, I believe, uses up your standard action. <laughs> so yeah. So and, think of it as standard is a stand is a is an action action at will is a bonus technically. Oh, all right. As a but okay. I'm going to use, I'm going to use, have Louise use Mystic Senses. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh, oh, the channeler ability. Yeah. And I, I'm, think uh, oh, I think this would be an oh crap moment for the guys. That's yeah. more, more me. Yeah. Actually, and if I'm looking at, and if I'm looking at this skill, right, I can use it on any, I can use it on any Pokemon that we're Within twenty yeah. meters, so or should we what? do feet? Within twenty meters. Ah, it doesn't, ah, it doesn't matter. You'll be able to get all the, all these guys anyway. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna get the trubbish, but I do have an idea. If you guys are okay with it. On Boggle? Yeah. Yes. Uh. It is on a hostile <laughs> Pokemon, remember. Oh, wait. Channel the target Pokemon. If you attempt to channel a hostile Pokemon, so, yeah, an ally, there's no roll. Uh, okay, oh, I'm going I'm going to channel I'm going to channel Bogdan. Okay. I like how my... Bungle is, like, the go-to option of, bu like, buffing up. Uh, Alright. Um, okay, so... I don't... Okay, so... And I'm going to have... I'm going to use Spirit Boost for my standard spirit. action. Uh, it's, what's Spirit Boost? When the, okay, when you use Spirit Boost, choose a channeled Pokemon. You may choose the target of Spirit Boost if you wish. While Spirit Boost is bound, the target has one of the following effects. That's one of the following effects, depending on the highest combat stat of the chosen Pokemon. In the event uh, of the you so, choose which stat to use. So what's Bogdal's highest stat? It's special attack stat. I'm plus with the helping hand. Jesus. Yep. Special okay, yep, special attack boost. So what happens? Okay, special attack. The target gain gains 
bonus damage when using special attacks equal to your intuition rank. Oh my god! <laughs> so whatever Louise's intuition, she gets actually do an extra damage. Yeah. Yeah, my I have novice intuition. So, so that's plus three. Oh plus three. God, oh my god, an extra plus three to bottle. That's, that's so plus thirteen. Right. Plus thirteen damage, okay. Is that it for your turn, Louise? Yep, I'm out. And with that, I end my turn. I'm scared. Fian and Bogdal. You should be scared of chicken. Uh, okay. Blossom and First Lena, be all, ready. Lena and Blossom, be ready. First of all, we've got to get this Pokedex roll out of the way for Trubbage. <laughs> I did it earlier. I did it earlier, and I want to get it out right now. Uh, you know what? I should put up the spirit boost just so everyone can see it. That would help. Yep, here we go. Trubbish, the trash bag Pokemon. It's not ugly. It just stinks. <laughs> oh. It stinks. It stinks. It stinks. It stinks. It stinks. <laughs> Pokedex begins to smoke. Yeah. Funnily enough, that was a two. One off of a crit fail. Oh, that's awesome. Also, Louise, that costs two AP on your thing, so please remove two AP from your character. Two, two AP? Yes. Yeah, action points. Yeah, that's what you got. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, how do... Okay. Char two AP. Go to your character sheet, and then at the bottom of like your name and things, there should be AP. Yeah, he'll get them back when you stop using it. I have, okay. a question ask, I have a question to ask ahead of time before my turn. Uh, if I'm going if I'm going to use one of these moves, do I click the um Okay. Oh there which, we go. Which which one is it that I which one is it that I click? Which it's which the, it's the name under known moves. Alright. Do I do the right. roll damage? No, which okay. is the last one? Uh okay. Um sorry, just doing it quickly so Thean's aware. So on the Pokemon on the Pokemon's character sheet on the characters on the on the Pokemon's character sheet, there's a small thing under skills where it says known moves. Okay. Uh, if you click the name of the move, it will do the roll with everything for you. And if you don't have any moves under known moves, under your move list, you'll have these little boxes off to the side. If you click on the inside of one of them, it'll turn red and add them to the known moves list. They're all there. Don't worry. I already did that, so yep. just click the move. So don't worry, Lena. We'll help you when he gets there if he needs a reminder, okay? Okay, I just wanted to know ahead of time so that my turn wouldn't take like 40 forevers. All right. 40 forevers. 40 forevers. All right, all right. So, Go ahead, Bongo. Right, so first, you never first of all... Nope. First of all, we got to move Bongo a little bit closer. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And you said that the boost applied whenever he used a special move. Mm. So we get to I'm have scared. fun. Oh no. So that trubbish over there is gonna get burnt. Barbecue oh that's Ember. that's a that's a nat twenty. That's a natural twenty. Oh my god. Oh no. So <laughs> hold on, we gotta do this so... properly. So it's burned. Actually it, it's gonna die. I'll tell you that much. So it's twenty seven. So... Half of 27 tw yep. plus the plus the critical call bonus of 10. Which is 37. Plus <laughs> the 13 from Ed earlier. 50. Minus Trubbish's special defense. It doesn't matter! <laughs> so basically, it's a crispy critter. Yeah. <laughs> it, it only has 30 hit points! <laughs> Oh my god. This takes dumpster fire. No, no, no. This takes dumpster fire to a whole new level. <laughs> what the frick? I feel You should know it's illegal to burn trash in a forest. I'd like to take this moment to thank Beatrice and Louise for buffing Boggle up to God status. And this is and this is why I wanted to, yeah. I, and then I would like to thank R and Jesus for the crit. <laughs> Uh, Dean, are you okay? Can you breathe, bud? A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. After you burn it, it's just looking at it going, No! Not my, not my poof! 
<laughs> its original its original name was Puff, but now it's Poof. <laughs> Be dead. <laughs> I believe you can come a dead later. Alright, well, the, the trainer's gonna use a trainer action and it's gonna use run away. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, you don't. He just barks off. <laughs> He's the one that goes, What the hell are you doing? Get back! Wait! Uh oh. Hello. <laughs> Just, this is the moment where we look. This is the point where we cross our arms and look menacing. <laughs> and, and uh, puppet looks. Puppet stares at him menacingly. Gojo menacing meme. All right, is that it for your turn? Oh, you're approaching me. Nah. I can't kick your ass if you're all the way over there. Uh, that's about all that we can do right now. Okay, Blossom, <laughs> Blossom and Momoko, off you go. Okay, so all I have to do is click the name of the move I want to use, and it'll give, and it'll do it. Yes. Yeah. You just... So before you do that, do make sure that your Pokemon's in range. Also keep in mind that, like right in between where Horsey and Trubbish are, there's a smoke screen. So if you try to attack uh, this Trubbish over here, uh, you're gonna have a slight disadvantage in accuracy. Okay, we're. Okay. Okay, I'm right next to Tycho, so I'm gonna have to move in closer. That's for darn sure. Do what you gotta because... do. Okay. So, so, I, so what I'm going to do is I'm gonna to, I'm gonna walk up to the guy with Blossom behind me. Oh, you're gonna go up to that one. Do you have? Is that? Can you move that many spaces? Uh, let me find out. Let me find out. Just double check the movement of Momoko and Blossom, just very quickly. Uh, yeah. No. Blossom. Blossom. Yeah. Blossom has a movement of twenty-five. So five spaces. Yeah, and I think Momoko has the same amount. Yeah, Momoko has the same amount. So, so I'm you want right here next to Louise? Okay. And Blo yeah, and Blossom can be right behind you. So I walk up to them and I and I say, "Well, well, remember me?" Oh, oh no! You again? Okay. And the move that I'm going to do is Razor Leaf, which has a. <laughs> <laughs> She's attacking oh. the trainer. Oh my god! Yeah, it's allowed. Go for the pants. Go for the pants. <laughs> Go for the pants? Are you serious? <laughs> make him lose his belt, make his pants drop to the ground, and make him embarrassed. It's up, it's up to Lena. What does she want to do? Okay, well, Razor Leaf has a range of two cones. It's... Yes. So, I don't know... Okay, so... I don't know if it would... Uh, I don't know so, if it... think of the cone as, like, the area in front of a Pokemon. And it would hit everywhere within like a certain range. So let's say if it was three feet, it would hit in a cone of three feet. So it'd be able to hit from all the way up here to all the way down here. Uh, okay. Okay. And I'm going, then I'm going to use, right, then I'm going to have Blossom use Razor Leaf. Just as the heads up, it's a cone of two, just as a room call. Okay, so you'd, you'd be able to go this far. Oh, she did, okay. you did shop it. Okay, well then... Okay, um, I don't think I can move any further, can I? Uh, not really. I mean, if you want to, I'd say you do have Growl, or you could do an Intimidation check if you want. Okay, well then, I will do Growl then. Okay, scare the fucker. Roll the okay. Growl! Oh, yeah, okay, oh, that went that went private to me. Uh, yeah, that's just about. Though no damage, it, do it, does, so it does give him a scratch, sort of... <laughs> This is pissing me off. Hey, no worries, it, no worries, don't no, worry. No, 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 The attack isn't what piss. It, the attack isn't what's pissing me off. What's pissing me off is that it's being sent directly to you and no one else can see it. No worries. Oh wait, it's an yeah. option on the Pokemon sheet. I'll help you with it afterwards. It's an easy fix. All right, thank you, Aeon. I really appreciate that. All right. Uh, you know what? Up. You know what? Why don't we make this generous? 
because we're back after all this time, I'll extend cone by th by one more square. You let's have some fun. Roll the razor leaf. Do it. Okay. I want to have some fun. No, no, oh, no, that's a miss. Oh, oh that's... How, did you miss, how do you miss that fat ass <laughs> it's in an, the field? An AC, it was an AC, uh, it was an AC of five minus four. <sighs> so it was a one. <sighs> Just missed us, I'm afraid. I'm getting the weirdest picture aim for the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> He fires the razor leaf and it just misses him and it's just the oh, 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 You weren't actually aiming at me, were you? Like when you did shot. that, you sounded like Hank Kill, like oh. <laughs> <laughs> You weren't actually aiming at me, were you? As a matter of fact, yes I was. <laughs> well then in that well in that case I'm about to bust my legs. Run away! <laughs> Why did I put this down to? Alright, the other two at the back are still there. Is that it for your turn, Lena? Yes, that's it. Okay, the Trubbishes oh. can finally have a go! Yay! And finally play! Yay! Hey, get a new toy. Um, the smoke screen has like a 3x3 um, a three three square radius, right? I'm aware. Yeah, you. Let's yeah. say the smoke screen is like right here. I think maybe is that all right. Okay. Yep. Yeah, let's have some fun. All right. The trubbish is gonna go. What do you think you're doing? Get that coward! And he's gonna run out with the max of his speed. Oh wow! He made it to that part. And uh, he's gonna use silver than smoke screen. Oh. Oh, yeah. just uh, yeah. There's nothing else he can do. That's the distance. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to risk it. Um, he's gonna roll sludge wave. What is Whoa! That? What? Yes. Sludge wave. Sludge wave. Uh, All right. Well, it's a twice per scene. So let's find out if I have some fun or not. Uh, 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 Michael, okay. I have some good news for you. At least he's close enough now for you to use the bubble next time. Yeah, I know. I mean, okay. So. It's minus three to the accuracy. <gasps> yeah, so. Uh, care to share with the class? Natural 20! What? Natural what? 20! No! Oh really? Yes! No! All right, so. Uh, uh, so that is, no. well, the fortunate displays is the dice isn't too bad. Sort of. Sword. Uh, okay. Um, <laughs> okay. Um, I didn't think it'd be that big when I put it in. Oops. Uh, no. <laughs> this should be fun. Okay. Uh, Trub oh, uh, Sledge Wave is a special. Uh, what's the special defense of Reggie? Um, eight. Okay. You take 68 points of damage. Oh my god. Was I killed? It's the... Reggie's knocked out. Wait a minute. How much? How how far below did Reggie go? Oh. Uh, let me check. Uh, Reggie was at. Uh, Let's say Reggie was at full health. How much health did Reggie have? Thirty. Thirty. It's... Oh wait, wait. It's... Yeah, thirty-six. 36 oh, and he wow. took how much damage 68 that you are so lucky four more hit points and reggie would be dead oh what four oh, more hit points you... reggie would have fucking died hang on hang on i don't think it dies quite that easily if i remember right it's like an injury. no it, no the, uh, it needs to go in injuries or it or if the maximum amount of damage is to it exceeds what your max health point is in the negative, yeah. I think that's death. Uh, you've got one injury from massive damage. You went past uh, 50 and zero. So that's another two injuries. <laughs> uh, 
Oh my god. Um, Wait, I'm going to... Hang on. I'm going to... I'll look at Pokemon Death while he does the injury calculation. Okay. Um, okay, what was the a, uh, the AC for or sludge, the sludge wave roll? Two. Yeah, no, okay. No, no, what did you roll? Natural 20. Um, yeah, that's with win. minus yeah, 18, yeah. so it's an 18 okay. technically. Oh yeah, because okay, oh the so... smoke screen, the smoke screen. Uh, 15. <laughs> okay, so it doesn't crit then, right? No, it does. It does crit. Uh, uh, it it does crit. It just meant it was less chance of hitting you because of the smoke screen, but it still beat the two of the AC of the move. Okay, so how death works? If a if a Pokemon or a trainer has 10 injuries. Or it goes down to either minus 50 hit points or minus 200% hit points, whichever is lower. So in that, dead, you did just pick up four injuries. Okay. I thought it was... That's my bad. I thought it was much worse than I thought. You nearly gave me a heart... Like, that gave me a heart attack. I was like, what the hell, dude? So... Oh, he got insta... Insta KO'd. Yeah. And now, uh, and now, to... and now, this rubbish. I'm not gonna be cruel. I'm not gonna do it again. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking do it again. Yeah, I was so tempted, but you know what? It's just gonna roll a simple pound. Uh, I'm so sorry. I didn't expect it to do that much. Anyways, Reggie is fainted. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let me. <laughs> <laughs> so he returns Reggie to the Pokeball. Yep, that's fine. Yep. It's going for the pound on uh, Elizabeth. That hits, and Elizabeth takes the 14 points of damage. Uh, oh, that's with uh, defense calculation, right? Uh, oh, my. Oh, yes. I forgot about that. Sorry, sorry. Tell you what, while that's going on, that's going to be the end of the Trubbishes. Uh, Kizuna, off you go. Uh. <laughs> Right. Uh, well, seeing that it attacked one of his friends, Arlen is definitely going over. <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, Elizabeth only took seven points. Oh, not bad. Arlen's got four overland speed, so Arlen is going to go there. Kitsuna is going to follow. And Arlen is going to use his cheerleader ability to motivate Kitsuna. Okay. Uh, which doesn't really do anything you need to worry about. I'm just doing it for effect at this point. <laughs> he's, just gonna, oh, he's just gonna pat the little route to the back and go, Go on, show me what you can do. All right, what are you doing? And Kizna is going to turn, look at the rubbish, and use confusion. Oh no! Oh boy. Well, <laughs> I think that's within range. Also, also, Caitlin and uh, Mochi, be ready. All right. <laughs> All right. Roll. Did a lot of it. Yep, that hits, and that's twenty-two. Plus, it is weak to psychic move, so half of that. Yeah, insta insta KO'd. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ninety-nine. God Ooh. damn it! <laughs> da Oops. Oh. Oh. Did I mean to do that? Did yeah. I mean to do that? Yeah. Uh. Oh wait! Oh, she dropped Did out. Did I do that? Yeah. No, I'm, I'm, I'm coming back in. I'm coming nice. back in. That was an accident. Yeah. I'm back. I backed up by accident. Yeah, he's gonna. He's you know he's gonna use his trainer action. He's gonna try bolt it, but uh, he's, he can't go over cliffs. So he's stuck on the edge, and he has to make a check afterwards. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, uh oh. oh it's a kid's in go. Oh, well done. <laughs> nice. That one's a bit of a move. All right. Uh, that's... Uh, bottom <laughs> of the barrel, we wrap back round. Yep, yeah, top of the round. Back to Mochi and Caitlin. All right. Okay. Okay. Three. Just... I'm sorry for the count. Three. Sorry. Four. Bye. Just be aware, you are. That is. Uh, that is. Oh, just outside of the smokescreen range. Well, it also applies to if she's attacking into. Uh huh. Yeah. So, whereabouts is the smokescreen? 
Well, it's on top of, if I remember right, smoke screen starts here and it goes over this way. So, oh, you're in the, you're in the smoke screen range. So oh. basically your thunder shock is going to be a minus three to attack with it. All right. Uh, well, yeah, I, oh yeah, I get to move one more spot too, because get seven. Oh, Would have been minus three if uh, she was attacking into it as well. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I'm also going to have Holly move a bit closer too. I'm really sorry about this. I have to count That's so cool. I don't lose count. <laughs> Well, this is definitely a battle, all right. Yeah. All right. Okay. Ooh. I'm going to have. Okay. So, Trubbish is there. Okay. 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 I'm so sorry. I'm so nervous. That's cool. I I did think I just think this bear just have two. I just uh, have so many ideas. <laughs> it's all right. Okay. Just let, gl right. let Gladian motivate you. <laughs> Gladian motivate me. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. So, can Holly see the guy that um, that attacked um, that attacked um, the 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 horsey? No. Not not the trubbish, but the the trainer. Nope. He's just nope. in it still. Just in it still. Okay. Yeah. All right, I'm going to have. I'm going because uh, how much hate how much HP do trainers have? Depends on the trainer. Depends where they put their stats. But if you do, you don't know about what these guys have. All right, I'm going to. No, no. In fact, yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to attack the trubbish. All right. Roll that thunder shock. If uh, roll the attack you're going for. Because I don't want him to attack. Um... Right. <laughs> That's a nat twenty. That's a nat twenty. Oh wow. Oh. Minus three is fifteen. That still hits. Seven plus the four. Why do I? Why do I even bother? So the trubbish oh, thing. Oh, I was so... uh. Yep. Oh, what were you gonna? Do? Holly yells out like, Le "Leave my friends alone." And as as the smoke sort of dissipates a bit, you look and you see Tycho recalling the horsey, knocked out. So you do see it there, and at that point, the trainer just goes. Well, at least I got him. Run away! Mm. Yeah, you had, yeah, you had better run and tell and tell your superior I'm coming for him next. All right. I thought it could still be gunshot, but I'm not bringing my own. I'm going with your ticket. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wow. That's it. So at that point, the battle's over. Smoke screen dissipates. There. Yeah. What about this guy who's still on the cliff? Uh, oh yeah, he's still there. He's just uh, you know what? I'm just gonna make a random roll to see if he even decides to make the jump or not. Uh. uh... <laughs> this ledge. Oh no. no! Oh no! I'm making a. Ah! <laughs> oh. <laughs> you fall flat on his face, Delphi. <laughs> oh. Mm. Okay, we're out of combat? Yes, you are out. I will say you're out of combat. Mm. Um, good, good, Riddler. Okay. I... I then approach the girl. Are... Are you okay? She's just there, just sort of gasping a bit, just looking at what's going on, just like, Who are you? What's going on? Shop it. Oh. Shop, um, Shop it's going to try to make silly faces to cheer oh. her up. Oh. Oh. You... You have a spirit of the world, too? I... I nod. I'm sorry. 
That was... That was a lot to have happen. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry you all got dragged into that. You should have just left me. They... They... They were threat... They threatened the Pokemon. I will fight anyone who dares hurt Pokemon. Uh, th 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 thank you. Uh, um... What is... Uh, who... She looks back at all the rest of you a lot. Uh, who are... All of you? I point to myself. Louise. I, I point to my shuppet. Puppet. Oh. Okay. Uh, s sorry. Uh, I should... I should uh, properly introduce myself. Um, c could I just... Get out of this corner, please? Go right ahead. Take a step back. Louise is a woman of a few of a few words. <laughs> <laughs> Move. <laughs> it's officially. Uh, uh, thank you. Um. Uh, thank. You, uh, sorry. Thank you, everyone. Hmm. Pleased to pleased to make your acquaintance. My name is Yami. Yummy. Sorry, Yumi. Yumi, sorry. Y U M I. Yumi. Yumi. Okay. Yeah, sorry. I had wrong word. It's Yumi. Y U M I. And, and, and these are and these are my uh, these are my guardians with me. Uh, and she points to the petty lil. Um this is this is Dawn and these two are and she points to the phantoms. Uh, this is this is reuse, and this is after. Reuse Are you trying to go and for after. Any levels of puns? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, you all had to get roped into that. Those those thugs just came charging through, and they just got me while I was at work. Hmm. Figures they would bring up trouble here, though. Well, they came and said that a young, delicate flower like myself shouldn't have scary Pokemon with them. Your Pokemon aren't scary. As you, as you, say, as you say that, one of the phantoms has disappeared. Go, there's ghosts. Ghosts are nothing to fear. There, there are scarier things in the world than ghosts. As you say that, yeah, sure, sure. <laughs> uh, as that happens, Kemplop behind you. <laughs> do I know? Do I notice it before this happens? Uh, you can make one perception check to try. Okay. I I I didn't walk I didn't walk up to the girl. Yeah. And tell her that, that that what they said wasn't true. What they said isn't true. Any trainer can have any Pokemon that he or she wishes to have. That's that's what I said, but they didn't believe me. By the way, yes, uh, Kemplot, you do just about notice it, just as it goes. <laughs> see, not scary. <laughs> but you see, but you see, here's the thing. I believe that those men only wanted your Pokemon because of the fact that they look really strong. They may look strong, but strength isn't always a factor. It's how you raise it that matters. You definitely know what you're talking about. I tried to tell them that, but they wouldn't listen. They because they're, That's because they're thick-headed, unfortunately. Or they're bullies. Or both. Could be both. To be on it, to be, uh, Elizabeth sort of walks a bit over and just goes, "That sounds about right." I mean, we encountered all that we encountered those thought just before we came in here. Chances, yes, are I wonder if those were the same lot. I then took over. I then look over to to Elizabeth and say, "You know something, Liz? It could have been the same people that we that we that we came across earlier. In a way, it wouldn't surprise me whatsoever." 
Didn't we already establish that they were the same people? Yeah, yeah. Well, some of you were a bit away when it happened. You guys were fighting on the other side, so some of you didn't know it. Oh. Yeah. It do doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what they are. They tried. They're a threat to Pokemon. <sighs> threat to Pokemon. Therefore, you must die. Surprise me! It wouldn't surprise me if they were like poachers or something or thieves. Well, they said that they were some kind of enforcers, and they said that the scary shouldn't be with people like me. Oh, I I'm s I'm sorry. Uh, I didn't mean to come off of it there, but seriously, um, th thank you again for your help. I, I probably should get back to my work. No problem, Yumi. Work. I'll see you. I'll uh, see you around. Sometime. Oh, hang on. What's up, Adele? I said work. Oh. Um, I'm a care. I'm a caretaker for Petalburg Forest. My two Pokemon here have, basically, have the needs to look after most of the plants and the trees within this forest. Dawn helps to supplement the new life that gets created with seeds and flourishes and blooming, while reci while recycle and while recycle and after deal with the death of certain plants and trees and make sure that they recycled and, well, basically new ones are planted in their place. So beautiful. That is so amazing. Well, anyway, after at that point, just sort of looks up and does a sort of gentle sort of and just like a arms in the air like a cheer. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but still, I I can't thank you enough for your help. Um, I was actually just on my. I was actually just gonna be finishing up a bit of work. Um. Are you all heading through the forest? Yes. We are. Oh. Oh, in that case, could you... Uh, excuse me? Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I got affected by an Among Us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it just came out of nowhere. <laughs> no, sorry. Chris is a sleepy boy. I, I kind of have an, an evil idea. No. Uh... Regarding oh. the guy that's lying down in near the, where the cliff is. <laughs> yes. Oh no. <laughs> so, yeah. uh, what do you, you want to do? Push him off the cliff to his death? He's already oh, off the cliff. He's already off the cliff. Okay. Can I just have Holly like just go to the edge and see how he is? Sure. Go ahead. And make a perception check. Or tell you what. Make a perception or a uh, some kind of medicine or health check. I'm gonna do probably. But where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Is it medicine? Yeah, it's it, yeah, it's medicine. Yes. Uh, I I might not because it might be a bit too um, mean. <laughs> oh no! Holly's sweet. Holly's oh, innocent. Wow, so quiet in here. Hey. Caitlyn on the other hand. Oh, no. Caitlyn on the other hand. Not oh, so much. Uh, what? Uh, what he is currently down a cliff what? that is about seven foot of a drop, and he's currently got his face in the ground like, oh. I, I temporarily disconnected. Oh, no worries. Yeah, same here on my end. There's probably something in our area. Eh. All right. Right, so he's injured quite badly then. It looks like it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I can't. I, I'll think. I'll let you guys talk and then I'll think it over. <laughs> no worries. Okay. Uh, you. Yeah. Yeah. Yumi looks over all of you for a moment, just goes, Well, if you're heading through the forest, could you do a small favor for me, please? Sure. What's that? Well, I currently reside within the flower shop that's on the other side of Petalburg. It's an extra station that we have there. Um, could you head back there and deliver this little message report for me while I do the last lot? I'm a little wary, so I'm going to be a bit careful, but hopefully that's the last of those thugs after the beating I saw you all give them. We can only hope. We'll get this delivered for you. Oh, thank you. Um, when you make it there, just say, Yumi has the report. 
and just pass it to her and just tell her the situation. Alrighty. Oh, and one more thing. Um, Miss uh, Louise. Mm hmm? I can sense something about you. I don't know. Really? I don't know what, but be careful. You too. Hmm. Anyway, I should. Uh, I should probably get myself moving. Um, I should probably go check out the rest of the forest area. Just make sure you deliver that, and just tell them I'll be back shortly. Okay. Okay. Who does she give the papers to? Um, whoever wants to take them. Uh, um, Kemplar will take them, I guess. Fair enough. Oh, Holly, you're not doing what you're going to do? No, I was plan. I think it's just a bit too mean. I was planning on pouring honey on him to let wild Pokemon <laughs> him, but I think that might be a bit too mean. Oh, wow. Yeah. Well, that's, that's much more tame than what I thought you were going to do. Zap. What did you think? <laughs> What did you think that she was going to do? Because what I thought she was going to do was, if he was the if he was at the edge of the cliff, I thought that she was going to push him off to his death. I thought oh, she no. was going to pee on him. Damn, no. <laughs> Dude. Then I realized, no, that's not Holly. Bruh. No. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Anywho. Uh, and with that, she basically just gives a gentle nod, and she begins to walk past everybody. And as she's making a... Oh, whoops, I got Elizabeth in the process there for some reason. All right. As she's making her way past, she does stop near you for a moment, Tycho. And she looks at you. Uh-huh. Mm. I could see within the fog what happened to your partner. I'm sorry it happened because of me. Yeah, Taika, he's not gonna say anything to, uh, he, he's Engrossed. seething bad. That's, he's seething badly. That's fair. Yeah. With that, she just gives a sorrowful bow, and she just makes her way to the eastern direction. Okay. My AP keeps eastern? resetting. Yeah. Oh, no, My western AP direction, keep... sorry. My AP keeps resetting back to six. Uh, oh, it... I put it at four. No worries. Uh, I, I don't know about the health bar thing. We'll find a way to work on that. Yeah. I, I've changed it in the sheet, so it's so it's fine. That's fine. All right. Well, with that, the moment has passed. <laughs> Oh, the moment has passed. Well, it worked. well, the good news is that number is now completely off the table. Yay. So, uh, Yay. everyone, please, so everyone, whatever you do, uh, please do not roll a two. <laughs> if we roll a two, what happens? <laughs> I'll think about it. Okay. Well, I will say that is actually the majority of the thing I wanted to sort of have happen and concerning the time at this point. Uh, do you guys want to press a bit of time and we push a bit forward or do you want to keep rolling? Uh, keep rolling. Okay, if that's if if that's what the group wants to do, it's up to you guys. We're pushing forward. All right, let's onwards to adventure. All right, uh, who's handling the next one? Who's rolled so far? Arlen will handle the next one if you want. Okay. All right, Arlen, which way? Backwards or up? Uh, well, there's no point going back, so oh, onwards and upwards. All right, upwards we go to the next checkpoint. Why is it? Why is it still covering darkness? Darkness, darkness, darkness. Oh, darkness, darkness, darkness. Thanks. Now you finally give me it. Submit to the darkness. All right. Oh. Okay. All right. Oh. If you would, up there, please. So, over here. So, how was that battle? That, that was, was fun. fun. Oh, 
That was fun. <laughs> I am so I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Floof. It, it's part of the game. You know it's part of the game. <laughs> eye for an eye. <laughs> All right. Tommy, what are you doing down there? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. Oh fuck! Sorry, I was like, I fucking uh, sorry. I was trying to do. You blanked out, did you? All yeah. right, Alan, D10 for me, please. With pleasure. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> Don't. Hey. Say the, hey, do not. Do not say those words because something bad could happen if those words are spoken. A four. Hmm. Well, we haven't gotten a how do, how do I want to have this happen? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, Arlen. Yes. I'll give you a chance to save yourself at this point. Uh -oh. Okay, so to explain what happens, as you begin walking forward... You begin to hear the sound of something fire in your direction. You hear like a and something is firing your direction. I want you to choose a direction. North, west, east, or south. Noise. Oh sorry, that's rain. That's rain. It's all encompass directions. Yes, you yeah, you hear a noise coming at you basically. Uh, I'm going to dive to the north. North, so you're going to go up. All right. You fire yeah. north and from the west and fires towards and just missing Bogdan and Kemplar. <coughs> you see a purple stinger sting into the ground. Oh, shit. oh poison sting. Yep. As, oh, shit. as uh, something attacked you from beyond the trees. But you dodged out of the way. Uh... Can I roll perception to see where who shot that? Where? Uh, not on this occasion. Not on this occasion. No, this this fine. this one's a surprise round, so it's all about surprises. Okay. Yeah. No is there. All right. Okay, that's all for that one. Uh, who's next? We're almost to the top. Uh, uh, Lena. Uh, Lena, you can go next if you'd like. Wait, what happened? I, I was I was busy reading a text. Sorry, what happened? Uh, in short, poison sting came off from beyond the trees. Arlen missed it. Oh, so basically, it? yeah, it would have been a free poison sting attack from something. <laughs> it would have been basically something fired, and then it missed, and then it fired, and then it fired, and then it missed. Oh, missed great. Anyway, uh, Lena, if you want to take the next one, that's fine by me. Okay, well then, what are the directions they were able to go in? Uh, your directions are uh, west, south, or back east. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. See, east, south, north, or west. Uh, well, okay, I'll make it a easier. Not north. Okay, so east, so south, east, or west? Yes, yeah, so you could go down the cliff back the way you came. You could go east if you want to, or you could go on west to carry on. Um, let's see. How about we go west? West? Okay. Everybody to the next checkpoint. To the to the west. Yeah. <laughs> no. I thought you said west. <laughs> Not now, Ed. <laughs> That's West, Patrick. You're fine. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> yeah, Squidward. Yeah, Squidward. <laughs> okay, so... Susie. Okay, Susie's out. All right, good to know. All right, Lena, D10. Okay. Oh, man, Arlen's all the way over there. <laughs> Hal, what are you doing back there? Oh, fuck, why did I get locked down? <gasps> oh! Uh, uh, the ice and the poison here. Really? I'd like really? to stay where I am. <laughs> All right. Really? Natural one, a one? Okay, well, just remember, just so you know, this is just a normal ten. This doesn't mean one is bad. I mean, look what the eight got you. 
Yeah. Okay, a one. Oh, okay. Um, you find, uh, you do find something on the ground as you walk, um, Momoko. What is it? Uh, well, you do see that there are two sparkly objects, and you hear the sound of something sort of like a coming from one of the two objects. You can choose one. Left or right? Oh God. God, I hate this. <laughs> <laughs> I could be dead. I'll tell you right now, it's not a death. That I'll be honest to you. Dead. I didn't mean it literally, though. No, it's okay. <laughs> right or left? What I have a feeling like it could be Pokeballs. Could be anything. You don't know. Could be, could, could be a boat. Could be a box. Could be a box. In a, could be a boat in a box. Could. Maybe a box. We could boat. be immortals. Maybe. Anyway, go ahead. Go ahead, Momoko. So, actually, choice is yours. You can take a chance at the item, or you can just walk on. Be safe and just walk on. You're walking on. You're not going to risk it. I'm not going to risk it. I'm not stupid. Okay, fair enough then. Right, good to know. All right, so no item chance there. Wait, can I? I was going to say, can I? Could could we mm. roll a perce per perception see if we can notice the items? Nope. Oh. That's why I said you choose your leaders. <coughs> All right. Uh, you know what? Since Elizabeth is the only one who hasn't gone. I haven't gone. Oh, you haven't gone. Sorry, sorry, um, Theon. Do you want to have a go, or do you want Liz to have a go? Ladies first. All right. Hey, fuck you. What a, wow, what a gentleman. <laughs> Such a gentleman. <laughs> All right. Uh, you know what? Elizabeth's going to go, well, I've been here. We're almost at the exit. All right. Whoops. That's the wrong, that's the wrong thing. Oh, wow. I can keep the arrow on the screen. How did you do that? Uh, so to do that, if you hold shift and then drag the arrow, it stays. Huh. Oh, man. That's and if, cool. And if you want to get rid huh. of it, if you want to get rid of it, you just click the ruler symbol again. Oh, no, you just click, Apparently. you just, you just click the, uh, wait, hang on. That's just, oh, there you go. It looks like just, looks like just clicking works. I right clicked and that got rid of it. Too. Fair enough. Oh, why, now, why are you giving me, why are you giving me darkness again? Darkness, darkness, darkness. Darkness, darkness, darkness. darkness. All right. Darkness. Right. Oh. Okay. On to the next checkpoint, if you would, please. Hey, we, hey, we could come across some ghost Pokemon in the darkness. <laughs> are you all having fun? Are you, all, are, you all, are, you, are you Are you generally scared of my... Are you generally scared of this? Yeah. No, I'm having fun. No. I'm no, having fun. It's like the dungeon crawler route. For this, what do you expect? I had, I'm having fun. Yeah, I had to give you guys something. You guys are the battling and catching. I had to give you something. Oh, I would have been so happy if I caught that Among Us. Of course you would. You would have had an overpowered Pokemon that probably wouldn't listen me. to me. Me? Why are you blaming me? And fucking um, Ken Kempler has a fucking B drill. I think I worked the... hard for B drill. <laughs> Isn't Beatrice like level eight or something? Yeah, it's like actually I think it's level nine now. Yep. Yeah. No, Beatrice like super powerful though. Yeah. Uh, Momoko, are you moving? Oh. Uh, Lena. Hello. Lena, are you there? Uh, Lee. Oh, she's muted. Ah. Uh, yeah. What's now that? she's not. Now, are you moving? Which, yeah. Were you move moving? Move the character. Oh, okay, hang on. Yeah, no worries. All right, uh, Elizabeth is going to roll the D4. Oh, no, D10. Uh, uh, I was about, I was to, about say, to say, you had us roll D10. Yeah, sorry, <laughs> I said D4 before. Yeah. I said the four. All right. Please, please share with the class. A three. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, my. Oh. Um... <laughs> You hear a faint whistling going on in the trees. Golems fall, guys. 
Not that, not that, not that. More like gentle wind, wind whistle, not hard loud. Oh, sorry. Wind is blowing. Okay. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Um, that's all. Literally nothing? Nothing. Literally nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I, t I told you some of these numbers are eventful. I never said all of them were eventful. I'm going to roll a Pokemon education you. check just to make sure. Okay, go ahead. I, 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 don't, I, don't, tr I don't trust a single whistle in the air. In other words, Brownie is deceiving us. <laughs> Six. <laughs> 17. Uh, okay, you hear the wind in the trees? You do see a couple of Pokemon just flying just over the free the tree oh, the free tops. Tree tops! Um, you do see the sight of a couple of Pidgey just glowing, uh, so flowing by as the wind just blows against the branches, giving them a little spook. That's all. I, I really, um, actually, wait. I, because... Uh... I, I really want to... Are we, are we close to the exit of the forest? You don't know that. Oh, wait. Oh, no. You've been here before, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah. You know you're close. Right. I... Pardon? You really want something to happen, do you? I... Really to happen, you? I... Yeah. But <laughs> even, even if I have to make it happen. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, Kempler hasn't gone yet. Yep, it's oh, Kemp has... yep, Kemplar's, t Kemplar's turn. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. Okay, first of all, we have to read the sign. It's very important. <laughs> yeah, good. You read the sign. Okay, you read I forgot about that fucking thing. Oh, yeah, as you see the sign, uh, yeah, if you want to, that will count as your turn if you're going to do it. <laughs> oh, that's mean. <laughs> what are you going to do? I already used... Well, well, you have all four directions to choose from this time. Kemplar already knows the way to the exit, though, right? Yeah, he does. Let's just see if he remembers. Oh crud! You're right. <laughs> yeah. Why do you think I rolled? Uh, at the, why do you think I rolled at the beginning? Yeah. Fair enough. Uh, we're heading northward down. You're going north. Yep. All right. Congratulations. We. <laughs> That's the exit. Congratulations. That's the exit. I, I want to, before we exit, I want yeah. to pop some honey down, to see if it will track any Pokemon. Oh my fucking god. I want a, I want a Pokemon. Are you, I didn't plan any encounters. I, <laughs> you, can, you can just veto it just because it's not her turn. I, I could do <laughs> If you really want to, I can do it, but we'd have to end the session if that's the case, because I have not made a single encounter. No, no, worries, sorry. It's all right. I, I've been busy with just... getting work and things, and that's why I wanted to know what was going on. No, no worries. So, yeah, if I could just pop a honey down. All right. All I... right. Let me have a Because I know what the I know what the gym is and I don't want to go in unprepared. It's the same the gym. Only applies to the diet holder of the gym. You have a you have a shelter, don't you? Yeah, but it only guess what? It's it's only attacking moves is tackle and withdrawal. If you really want to do it, then we might have to do a stop to do it because yeah. we'd have to stop the session if we're going to. Because I generally have not got a single encounter planned. We also don't know the typing of the gym and if yeah. the typing of Westboro is the same. No, they said it was rock. Yes, yeah. it was announced it was rock. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so... Yeah, because I, I mentioned think... before when you guys were leaving, you saw that uh, you saw the Westboro gym leader was having a ceremony. Yeah. Yeah, it's rock. So, yeah, I... If it's alright with you guys, I want to put down a honey and see what I'll get. I guess we're entering the session after this. Alright. Uh... If, if it's okay with you guys. I am... Uh... I don't know. I don't know. 
I'd say we at the very least return the uh, or give the letter to the people at the flower shop. Because then if you think after that, we can always just come back in here. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. You guys know this and you guys know that the flower. If I let me help. Let me help you out here. I'll make it easier so you guys can see exactly where the shop is. Yeah. Ooh. Real close. Big ass lake. Yeah. There you go. That's the yep. flower shop right there. Oh, right. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I'm so sorry. I thought, like, we just, I, it's been a while. I, I forgot there was a flower shop. I, I just assumed that we go straight to the respiro. No, 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 not this time. Yeah, this is where you get the whalema pail. Oh, yep. oh, yeah. I'm so sorry. I forgot. I know. Yeah. Plus, there, plus there are catch area. Plus, there are catch opportunity areas. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't know. I just, because I know uh, the forest has, like, a chance to get a shroomish. I don't... There's a pond for water types. There's grass behind the flower shop. I, I, just... <laughs> I just, I just want to poke on more grass type. <laughs> she, she wants that coverage. Yeah, because I, you know, electric grass wasn't fun, especially elect, especially grass rock. <laughs> well, it's entirely up to you. It's entirely to you guys, but. No. I'll go to the flower shop. <laughs> all right. Flower shop. All right. Sorry. Well, it's all right. Flower shop first. All right. Well, that means we get put on the map here. Yep. You guys can spawn yourself on the map down there. Ooh, hey, look, it's the flower shop. Hey, look, flower shop. I swear that's the thing we've seen before. <laughs> uh, well, at this scenario, as you guys are making yourself out of the forest area you do see the flower shop to your western direction there and as you come out of the forest you do hear a sound coming from inside of the forest from the uh from the uh the flower shop sorry from the shop no no shut up <laughs> You actually do hear a crash, like a smashing sound of. Thank you. That's perfect. Yeah, thank you. Oh, that didn't. Oh, that didn't sound good. Yeah. So, so yeah, you hear a louder, and then just as you're approaching, you hear another one. Oh. Uh... Thank you. <laughs> really doesn't sound good. Okay, puppet's going to turn invisible and sneak into the shop. All right. Well. As he's about to crouch there, bonk! Aww, he get yeah. he gets he gets whacked, Boom. and something greets him at the door. Give me a minute. Oh. Give me a minute. All right. I need to get something because I realized I didn't think we were gonna get here, and I forgot to get this. Uh oh. Jesus. No. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. Oh, no. Jesus. <laughs> Pina Colada? Getting caught in the rain? No. Mm -hmm. Shut up. <laughs> All right. All right. Oh, oh my gosh. Momoko, you shrank. <laughs> Momoko's a child. <laughs> Pedalberg once changed her, man. She's never been the same since. <laughs> all right uh let me just get this because i need to have some fun with this <gasps> Ooh, actually no that's an idea uh -oh. i have a favor to ask mm? could someone get rid of the tiny momoko and fix this please no it's i got this thank you Anyway, so yeah, as Shop It basically is there, bonk, something whacks into him. Shop it. I guess the Pokemon has Shraggy. Scrappy? Scrappy, that's it. Scrafty. Well, not quite. As coming out of the door, you hear this. And standing in the doorway 
Inosol? What? What the fuck? How the what? fuck? How the fuck did you get it's so small? How the fuck did you get <laughs> How the fuck did you get in a fit in there? And that's where we're gonna end tonight's session. No. <laughs> With, permi with permission, can I do a Pokedex roll? Uh, mm. go ahead. No, that's not Garatina. That's yeah, not Garatina. Before, 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 before we end, I have a question to ask. Can someone, can you please put Blossom on the map as well so that we'll have it ready for next time? No worries, I can do that. Uh, but yeah, actually beforehand, uh, Kemplar, as you go to scan, no data recognized. That's not a guillotine. I was, I was gonna do the same thing. I was gonna do the same thing. I said I was gonna say guillotine. Data not found. <laughs> well, no data available. As it comes out, though, I will say it does do one thing. It looks in the direction towards Louise, mm -hmm. and that's where we'll end tonight's session. Oh shit! <laughs> oh shoot! I was expecting some adults to be there. Like what? A grass type Pokemon. <laughs> John Cena. I'm telling you right now, if a bug came out of that, Holland would be up here. <laughs> right. But but with that said, that's all for tonight's episode. Well, everybody, I'm so glad we're back. Woo. Yeah. So the question, of course, and this is. What exactly is the deal with this Giratina in the pathway? Is there some kind of hidden meaning? And why is it looking at Louise? And more importantly, what exactly were those thugs doing involving the poor little girl? Well, you'll have to tune in next time to find out. So I'll see you guys in two weeks when we figure out what the fuck we're doing here. <laughs> oh, I got you good with this one. Could this happen? Thank you. Sorry for your ears. But with that said, everybody, if you were charged with joy with this, with oh god damn it, right at the end. Was that was that the heavy? Yes. All right. But with that said, everybody, perceptions roll low. It's time for us to go. So with that said, everybody, let's see where this story also takes us in two weeks. What? Can I, can, can I get a, can you got, can I get some Fs in the chat for Yeah, for Reggie. poor horsey, yeah, for Reggie. On the verge of dying. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it was a nat 20, but, there's not much I could do about that. Please give, somebody please give the horsey some love. <laughs> yeah, there's F in the chat for horsey. Anyway, with that said, let's see exactly what's going to happen from this point. So until then, everybody, it's goodbye from Brownie, your dungeon master. It's goodbye from Aeon. Yay. Del. Boy, everybody. Caitlin. Bye. Floof. Um, oh, hang on. Here it is. No, no. <laughs> oh, Reggie. Uh, from Lena. Say Peoples, see you next week. Oh yeah, for normal D and D and Fian. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Disadvantage for the next one. <laughs> for both of you two. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Anyway, with that said, this is Brownie of the Joy Charge Gamers signing off on Let's Play Live Pokeception. Stay charged, catch you all later, and goodbye. Bye-bye. Bye. Giratina's gonna kill you. <laughs> <laughs>